And just like that, we're live, ladies and gentlemen. I was talking to myself for like five minutes, but anyways, in any event, hope everyone's having a fantastic Sunday, um, and you guys can hear me. Uh, no, that was a complete joke. I was just kidding. Hopefully you guys found it funny. Let's uh, take a look at Kanji's inventory, uh, because I did promise him so many inventory streams to review his inventory, um, and now it's time. So if you take a look at the Discord server, it is still open, so you guys are still able to submit your inventories. All you gotta do is just join the Discord server and send me your links to your inventories, and uh, yeah, we will get started. Sorry about that, the mic is back. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Alright. What can I say? It's a Sunday. Leave me alone. <laughs> Alright. Let's hop back into this in-game mode and take a look at Kanji's inventory. How about that? Alright, so... Here we go. Kanji Club, long awaited. He has a Synchedia, dude. Of course he does. Nice, nicely done. Field-tested Synchedia. Um, I don't know if you're planning on holding on to this skin in the long term. Are you going to sell it? Did you get it as a drop? In any event, here it is. Hope you guys um, like it. I mean, I think it's a good trade-up skin. He also has an AWP op Mana War with some envious stickers also looking pretty good if we keep going we have um, a stat trek desert eagle naga we have a bayonet knight out of all bayonets he went with a knight this is a field tested bayo which you know it doesn't look too bad you know I would have liked a little little lower float than that but hey it's fine it still looks pretty good and um, it's a bayonet after all. I mean, those those knives are uh, going up in price. Um, and we have an M4A4 Desolate Space. A couple cases. If we go to the next page, we have a Stat Trek USPS Guardian. I'm curious where he put the sticker. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Uh, we also have a Stat Trek AK-47 Uncharted with some nice um, Renegades foils. So those are pretty cool. Renegade uh, player foils. And uh, if we keep going to, let's see here, the next page. Um, nothing too exciting on this page. If we keep going, we have a Glock 18 Water Elemental. This time with a Renegades Hollow. Kanji Club seems to really like his Renegades. Um, his Renegades team, so that's kind of cool. See anything else exciting here? We got just a bunch of these. I mean, these skins are awesome. Factory and you, they're all a bunch of these random skins. I wonder if you got them in drops or did you actually buy them? Like, I know this one you have to buy or unbox, but that'd be nuts. That'd be cool if you got this as a drop. The cash collection. Let's see. Keep going. Agent Ava. Very nice. Very nice. Just a random shattered web case, ladies and gentlemen. That's interesting. Uh, just sitting around there. I'll take it. I'll take it. Hey, Angie, coming in with the super chat. You already reviewed my inventory. I just want to say hello. That's all right, Angie. I mean, if if you want, I can still review it. Um, if something changed that's that's worth uh, taking a look at, uh, I'm st you can you can always like send me your inventory again. Thank you. Thanks for the super chat. Let's see what else. What other inventories? Are there what other skins in this inventory are there? He has the Halo collection, that's pretty cool. And uh let's see, anything else? I don't see anything else here. Uh A D asks, Did you read my tweet DM? Maybe. I I don't know. Perhaps. Uh I should have responded. Um, how do I send my inventory link? You have to join the Discord server. So basically what you do is um, you go into a CSGO game and you see this link and then you alt tab into this overlay and you copy this link up here and uh, you go into the Discord server under the inventory review channel and post your link there. That's all you got to do. 
Let's see, anything else, Kanji? Do you have any other... Uh, uh, and Kanji, feel free to let me know in the comments if I skipped over something uh, important that, that's worth noting. I'm, I'm just looking and trying my best to find the, the most exciting... Most exciting things to show. Let's see, I think that's it, unless I'm skipped over something cool. He has a couple of these souvenirs. He probably unboxed, and this one's an Elige, so that's kind of cool. An old, old OG um, souvenir skin. That's awesome. Not bad, not bad. Overall, I'd probably say, Kanji, you probably... You... <laughs> You probably deserve a 10 because you've waited so long for me to review your inventory. It's not bad. All that's missing is some gloves. If I were you, I would uh, definitely try to offload the Synchedia at some point before its price goes down and uh, start investing in either stickers or cases. And in you know by the next major or after the next major, I can easily see you have some gloves. So that's awesome, Kanji. Thank you so much for your patience, man. Let's take a look. Who is next after Kanji? Let's see here. Let's see. What else we got? This guy is from Serbia. He has a Bowie Knife Forest DD Pat. Name tag 31. I wonder why he named it 31. So that's not a bad looking Bowie Knife. Looks kind of cool. It's one of the knives that the Forest DD Pet actually looks good on. <laughs> not bad, not bad. Let's see. He has a bunch of these cases, Prisma, Prisma 2 cases, Danger Zone cases, M4A1S Atomic Alloy. Um, this is a really underrated M4A4 or M4A1S skin. Um, kind of underrated. He also has an op red line with these Lambda stickers. Also underrated. I think... This op deserves more love, but that's for another video. Let's see if we keep going. We have some um, some cases here, some more cases. We have, what else do we have in here? A bunch of cases, a bunch of just random Safari meshes, Urban DD pads. I wonder if he got them, uh, you know, as drops or not, but a Hydra case. Okay, maybe he got that as a drop. Some more cases. This guy is just collecting all these random cases. These old cases, actually. Revolver cases, clutch cases, gamma or chroma cases. They're all pretty old. And yeah, this, this guy, electronic foil. Okay, interesting. It's kind of interesting. Let's see. Keep going. Bunch of cases, man. Just a bunch of these cases. A Bravo case. Finally, nice. Maybe he also got that as a drop. That's awesome. Interesting. Not many people keep their Bravo cases when they drop them. A lot of people just usually sell them to get a quick profit. But this guy's holding on to his Bravo case, which is an interesting decision. CSGO skin guy. What do you think about the M4 Knight with four crown foils? Absolutely, I think it's an amazing amazing skin i actually have a knight with one crown foil not four unfortunately but one and uh, i think it looks really good so uh yeah putting four would just be really really good so that's awesome uh hoffman love you too man thank you so much for the support and uh yeah welcome everybody welcome to the stream we are reviewing inventories today so if you guys have your inventories please go and post them in the um, in the Discord server, it's still open for you guys to post, so don't be late. Let's see here, a bunch of these cases, Shatter Web cases, some Dick Stacy stickers, a random Esports 2013 winter case, because why not? He also has a couple other operation items, skins, graffitis of the like. He also has an M4A1S Basilisk. This is another underrated skin. I think it looks pretty good. You're going to get one next week? That's awesome, man. Congrats. Yeah. <laughs> Just got a CS20 case as a drop. CS20 cases are pretty good. Um, they have potential to go up in price, so you never know. I would hold on to your CS20 cases as they drop. Let's see here. Uh, Ronan, you're going to have to send me that inventory in the Discord server. So um, you're going to have to go here into Discord, into this channel. It's called... The inventory review channel here and you're gonna have to post it down here 
Um, you have a couple more minutes before it closes. So yeah, hurry up and do it. Let's see here. I think we are on this guy's inventory. Uh, but yeah, we're done with this inventory. I would say you got a lot going on, my dude. A bunch of cases. Well done with the cases. Uh, I would like to see a, some gloves at some point, some sticker investments. But either either way, you got you got a decent inventory. I'll give you an eight out of ten. Um, let's go on to the next inventory here. Okay, that's awesome, Valve. Please don't don't troll me like that. I feel like I feel like they changed their API and. Now I can't make many requests. There we go. Okay, well, in any in any event, uh, it's working, so no need to spam Fs in the chat, boys. I think it's working still. <laughs> Let's keep going before it stops. Let's see. We have an after image minimal wear. I also have an after image. I think it's a really nice Fama skin. Uh, this guy also has an AK-47 front side Misty with a bunch of Cloud9 stickers and a shroud foil. So that's really cool. That's awesome. I think that's really good. Really good. Nice sticker. Nice placements. And, um... Let's see. Anything else? A bunch of these blue skins. Maybe he was trying to build a blue-themed inventory. A Cortezera. Kenny S. Atlanta. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Very, very solid. Monkey Business. Couple other blue CSGO skins. Let me see this sticker combo real quick. It's an interesting sticker combo. Let's see, anything else? These skins are all pretty good skins. Just, yeah, not bad. He was, I guess he's building a blue-themed inventory. Next page, he has more blue skins. So if you guys are building blue-themed inventories, definitely take a look at this one. He has a bullet rain, Azure, Zebra, okay. The blueprints. The Atheris, he also has the Brightwater, another underrated CSGO skin. I think it deserves a little bit more love. But, uh, yeah, very nice, very nice. Yeah, not a bad inventory. Overall, I think you're doing well with this themed inventory. Ooh, he has an M4A4 Tornado. With blue stickers, of course, but still. Nice, 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 nice. Sun in Leo, Factory New, with a nice Skadoodle sticker, Minimal Wear, AK-47, Blue Laminate, uh, CSGO Skin Guy coming in with the Super Sticker, thank you man, thank you so much for supporting my channel, much much love to you, appreciate it, hope you have a fantastic day, and uh, yeah, these skins, these blue skins are really good, if you guys are building blue CSGO skin inventory, take a look at some of these, because definitely some inspiration this combo actually isn't too bad and uh, yeah just overall if you if you like blue skins these uh these are the ones for you absolutely not bad not bad i'm you don't have a knife but i will give you an 8 out of 10 just cuz your inventory is very nicely themed i do like themed inventories and i i think it's really good very nice solid inventory mark thanks for sharing dude Hey, what's up, Russ? Welcome to the stream. We're reviewing inventories today, so let's uh, move on to the next CSGO inventory. Let's see here. Who is next? Let's see here. Another blue-themed inventory. Wow, you guys really like blue inventories. Dang. Okay, so let's take a look at this guy's blue inventory. He has a souvenir indigo, and a Gev Dazzle. Let's see, uh, Guardian, USPS, the Rat Rod AK-47. The Glock 18 Blue Fissure. Yo, this sticker actually kind of looks cool. Who's, whose player sticker is that? Oh, Cutler. Oh, that makes so much sense. I was like, wait, what is that? And, okay, it's, it's a scissors and it's cutting him. Wow, that's actually really creative. I did not know this sticker existed. I didn't know this is how his signature was. That's awesome, man. Yo, Shivalaya, what's up? I got the 2015 Kados um, instead of the capsules. That's awesome, man, Shivalaya. Uh, thanks so much for the super chat. Congratulations on your investment into the 2015 Katowice stickers. I really hope they um, they come back and pay dividends for you. And, uh, yeah, hold on to them. I think you'll be in a good place um, 
throughout the next couple of months to years. Let's see here. What else does he have? He has a Decimator. That's kind of cool. I think a Decimator is an interesting M4 to go uh, if you're building a blue inventory. Because it's not like 100% blue. You could have gone with like a Brightwater or some other blue M4A1S skins. But Decimator's fine. Let's see. Navy Murano. The Ice Cap. The Mainframe. Let's see. Anything else? The Oceanic. Hello, hello, Gigabyte. Um... Eric, welcome, welcome, everybody. Welcome to the stream. We are reviewing CSGO subscriber inventories today. Hope you guys are having fantastic. Hey, Fano, Sapphire or Ruby? That's a good question. Sapphire or Ruby? I'm probably going to go with... I personally like Ruby just because red. I think red colors are kind of cool. Um, not. I think they're both fine. I personally like the Ruby. I think it looks better. But that's just me. Uh, let's see here. We got the P90 Offworld, the Cirrus, and then just a couple other miscellaneous miscellaneous uh, skins and graffitis. So, uh, yeah, the Guardian is the best blue M4. Uh, yeah, it is definitely up there uh, as one of the best and definitely consider it. Uh, depends upon the knife. Yes, that is true. Some knives look better in Sapphire. That I completely agree with you. Absolutely. Um, yeah, it really does depend on the knife. This inventory, again, it doesn't have a knife. Um, so, yeah, I'd probably give it like a 7, maybe. Yeah, it's a little small for me, so I think you should uh, expand on it. I'll give you a 7 just because it has a really cool a really cool um, theme going on. But, yeah, just... Uh, yeah, this, this just looks really cool. That's all I'm going to say. Let's see, who is next? Let's see, this was Mark's inventory? Or was it Freeze's? Hold up. Okay, so we are moving on. Let's see, take a look at this guy's inventory. Right off the bat, we see USPS Torque, we see an AK-47 Uncharted, um, and we also see a sticker Greyhound Gaming Hollow. Interesting, um, very interesting skins but uh, he also has a bunch of these clutch cases so that's nice nice investment right there a couple spectrum cases some gamma cases gamma 2 cases very nice this guy seems to be investing in cases he also has some foil stickers from berlin 2019 a bunch of berlin 2019 stickers device um autograph stickers that's pretty cool zyu stickers some capsules this guy has a ton of these Berlin investments that he's still holding on to, which, you know, it's kind of interesting. It's not a bad idea to hold on to them at the moment. Hey, what's up, Kenny? Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing fantastic. How's your day going? Welcome, welcome, welcome. We are reviewing subscriber inventories today since it is working. Since the new um, major is canceled, a new investment video is coming. Uh, yes, I do plan on... Um, I do plan on making an investments video and um, whether that be tips and tricks or stuff is coming. Let me just tell you that. Like, you'll just have to uh, subscribe and wait. It's coming. Hey, what's up, Game Master? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, this this is really interesting. Some Caddo 19 stickers this guy has as well. And then capsules. And then just, man, this guy is just has so many investments from 2019. He's holding on to them. Probably a, not a bad idea to hold on to them. But, yeah, let's see what, what happens. Um, again, I'll be, I'll be making a video on my my thoughts really soon. Let's see here. Anything else? Um, he has an, he has a, the Kronos G3 skin. That's interesting. Factory new. Yo, how much is this going for? Uh, I'd say, like, at least $100, no? I think it's pretty good. Um, let's see here. What else? AK-47 Orbit MK-01. Some more cases. The Op Worm God. Nice. Not bad, not bad. Not a bad inventory, to say the least. I think it's pretty good. You have a ton of cases, and you have some nice Berlin investments. Some nice skins, too. The USPS Orion. And for everyone else, Guardian. More cases, more old cases, and new cases. 
Yeah, this guy is, just has a ton of cases that he invested in. Did you get them all as drops, or did you actually invest in them? That's a good question. Cronus is 115 on the market? Yep, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. Let's see. All right, so, yeah, I this inventory, man. Uh, it's missing gloves? Whoops, if I can spell gloves. It's missing gloves. It's missing a knife. Um, all these cases. Okay, so... I don't know. Like, it's tough for me to give a rating for this because it just has investments more than it has actual skins. Um, I'd probably give you a solid 8. I think they're fine. Can you inspect the ones with stickers if possible? There are many stickers, but uh, let's see. Are there any... Here we go. Here are some with stickers. We can, we can take a look at them. Let's see. Surf's Up sticker. This obviously... A really nice combo. Ooh, he scraped his. That's pretty cool. Let's see the USPS Orion. Not bad. We have the Evil Daimyo. Some nice red CSGO stickers. The Op Mortis. Too old for this. Nice. Let's take a look at his Elite build. The Op Worm God with a... Fallen sticker, that's awesome. I think that's where you place it. Nice OG Fallen sticker. That's really good. And uh, let's take a look at the Orbit MK01. Are MIBR stickers spiking? That's a good question, Kenny. I don't know. I haven't taken a look at MIBR in so long. Who knows? Um, you'd have to look at the market graph and uh, do like a regression or whatever and see what's going on. But uh, I think it's fine. I think they are going up, and they probably will. Let's see. Okay, so not a bad inventory. Let's take a look at this next inventory, Mr. Wolf. Let's see over here. Right off the bat, I see an all pink DD pat, minimal wear, nice investment skin. Low, pretty low float minimal wear. I'll take it. I think it's really good. Hey, what's up, Kamal? Welcome to the stream. How you doing? Happy Sunday. Welcome, welcome. Let's take a look at this flip knife lore. Any lore knife is really good. This is a low float field tested, so I'm pretty happy about that. I think it looks good. How you doing, Docs? Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a fantastic day. What AK-47 should I buy under $10? Um, that's a great question. I, if you can get an Orbit MK-01, I think that's a good one. If you can get a... What other AK... I mean, pretty much, pretty much the uh, the Orbit MK1 is probably your best investment option for under ten dollars if you can find one. Let's see here, Corin, welcome to the stream. Hello, hello, hello. He also has an Op Neo Noir, looking fresh, mighty fine. Also has a case hardened with some nice Prism, not Prism, Noble Hollows. Those are pretty cool. <laughs> nice, looking good. Some emerald skins. Nice, nice, nice. The Twilight Galaxy with fire in the hole. Wow. Interesting. Interesting investment. Yo, Felipe Gringo, thank you so much for the $10 super chat. You're absolutely nuts, my dude. Um, here is my inventory. Thanks again, Fano. I got some new stuff. Thank you, um, Felipe, dude. Much appreciated. I'm going to review you next. Thank you so much for the super chat. You're insane, dude. You are insane. Thank you. Thank you, my man. Um, hope you have a great day. Let's see here. Um, USPS Blueprints, Dual Beretta's Moon and Libra. The AK-47 Neon Rider, that's a pretty nice skin. Nice sticker, too. Fits in. The Stalker. If we keep going to the next page, we got the Easy Headhunter AK-47 Redline. This is a really nice combo, a sticker combo that is worth taking a look at. Oh yes, the Phantom Disruptor is also a really interesting AK for under $10. Absolutely. Um, I think I'm on like number 5 in the Discord channel. So we're still early, but trying to get through all of them today. Uh, we got the AWP Magic Stick. Kenny S. Foil from Boston 2018. I think that's a pretty nice combo. Let's see, what else? If we keep going, we have the M4A1S Brightwater 
with some ooh, hollows, C9 hollows. I'm sure this looks really good in game. And uh, yeah, let's keep going. M4A1S, Mecha Industries, Minimal Wear, AK47, Aquamarine Revenge, Field Tested, looking, looking fine. I see a Containment Breach, that looks really good. I think you should definitely take a look at that. We got the Death by Kitty. I used to have one, but I was like, you know what? It's taking way too long for its investment to go up. So I was like, let me just sell it and uh, have money for videos and stuff and other investments. We have the Desert Eagle Cobalt Disruption. <laughs> Lucky one, Deeg. He scraped his Dick Stacy sticker. That's kind of cool. Yeah, just overall, you got some pretty cool skins in here. Nice Icarus Fell. The Sun in Leo with Navi stickers looks pretty good. Yeah, just overall, I think it looks really solid. I think your inventory is pretty solid. He has an Op Hyper Beast. He has another Emerald skin, some Whiteout skins, Kenny S stickers. Yeah, just overall, nice inventory. Nice, nice inventory. I'd probably give you a solid 9 out of 10. I think you're missing gloves, and that's just about all that's left. I would like to see some more sticker investments or case investments, but other than that, I think you're on the right track, and yeah, you'll be good to go. Not bad, Wolf. Thank you so much for sharing. All right, let's take a look at Felipe's inventory. Let's see here. Oops. Let's see what he has in his inventory. All right, so right off the bat in Felipe's inventory, he has an M4A1S Hyper Beast. Low float factory new, that's really good. Hopefully you didn't pay too much for this skin. He also has the Empress factory new with some really nice Gambit Hollow stickers. That's a really nice combo right there, chat. That's really good. He also has the Hellraiser's Hollow from London 2018 stickers, four of them. Are you Were you planning on placing them on the Empress or maybe some other red skin? Because these stickers are really good. I think they're pretty underrated. I think they deserve more more hype. I think they're... Look at look at them. They they just look so good. Um, I like that purple purple f uh, shade, if you will. He also has an M4A4 New Noir Factory New, five seven Hyper Beast Factory New. He loves his Factory New skins. That's awesome. He has some uh, uh, Tylu stickers, some Tylu Hollows from 2019. He also has this fuel injector with a bunch of Dick Stacy foils. Chat. That's awesome. Welcome to the streams, Derp. How you doing? Hope you're having a fantastic day. Take a look at this. Jeez, chat. <laughs> this looks uh this looks pretty good. I think this deserves this deserves a screenshot. <laughs> this looks uh pretty pretty fine, if I do say so myself. It's a yes from me. <laughs> um Nice, nicely done. Did you place these stickers? I imagine you did. That's awesome. Hopefully you didn't pay too much for these stickers. Uh, let's see here. Anything else? He has an Asimov P250, some Vici Gaming Hollows, some North Hollows from 2017. That's interesting. Uh, he also has the AK-47 Neon Revolution with some Windstrike Hollows. It's kind of hard for me to judge this combo without looking at it in-game. He has... The Cortezera with G2 Hollows from Face of 2018. Looking good. He also has Quantum Bellador Fire Hollows on the red line off. Also really solid. Let's see anything else. Wow, the Op Electric Hive with all these unicorns. Huh. Interesting. Interesting combo. The Bish Bash Bosh Boom combo i love it nice wrecked sticker up there and then bish bash bosh looking really good if i had a boom this is probably one of the combos i or one of the crafts i would make that's really good and uh let's keep going here we got on the next page he has a huntsman ruby just gorgeous knife he also has a huntsman sapphire i'm gonna take a wild guess you use this for your CT side, and you use this for your T side. That's that's just my guess. He also has Mouse Sports Hollow combo on his pink DD pad. Whoa. 
Dang, this combo actually looks good. Nice combo, man. Nice combo. This looks really good. Props to you, man. Like, you really... You put in some real thought and um, creativity here. Like, this... I completely forgot that this that these stickers look look this pink. That's awesome. Nice combo, nice combo. He has the USPS kill confirmed factor in you. He has a M4A4 M4A1 S Icarus Fell with VG Gaming stickers. The Aug Momentum Factory in you. Interesting combos. He has the Vogue Killjoy combo. That's awesome. Interesting. Interesting. He has the Integral, he has the AK-47 Vulcan with with the uh, Furia Hollow. That's kind of cool. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's see here. AK-47 Neon Rider with some nice North Hollows. Looking fresh. Op Containment Breach with some Spirit stickers, some Spirit Hollows from Cato 19 very solid. The wildfire with the four times dragon lore foil combo. This is a really nice combo, guys. Really good. Hyper beast with some Vici stickers, some uh, stickers on the op Onitaji, Hellraiser stickers. That looks really good. Hey, what's up, Luca? Welcome to the stream. I'm just reviewing some subscriber inventories right now. Nice fire starter combo, Felipe, dude. That's really cool. That's awesome right there. Really solid stuff. Let's see, anything else? I was about to skip over this op Azimov with these VP hollows from Atlanta 2017. That looks really good. He do be rich though, absolutely. Um, he's a he's a rich trader. Very nice, very nice. Some more Furia hollows. Blood in the water. Wow. Just 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 wow. Really good inventory. Whoops, skipped over a page. Looking really good. He also has gloves which are uh the turtle gloves uh which are minimal wear. If you're going to get turtle gloves, you probably should go with minimal wear or low float field tested at the very least because I do believe they do show wear and high float field tested don't look that good in my opinion. So, nicely done on minimal wear. And other than that, I mean, your inventory is just just solid, man. What else can I say? I've reviewed it in the past, and I've given you a 10, and I'm going to give you a 10 again. I think you're doing a good job, whatever it is you're doing. Um, your investments are good. Your skins are good. And, yeah, keep up the good work. Yeah, that's all I got to say. <laughs> keep up the good work, man. 10 out of 10 from me. Thank you so much for uh, donating and supporting the channel. Thanks, Felipe. All right. Let's go back into the Discord and take a look at Fury's inventory next. Let's see here. See what else is in this inventory. Um, right off the bat, we see a Shattered Web case. I see a Abyss, an Evil Daimyo with some Mouse Sports stickers. Looking good, looking really good, actually. I probably would have placed this foil somewhere up here, but that's fine. It's still not bad. He also has the AK-47 Empress fuel tested. That's awesome. One of my favorite AK-47 skins. One of the uh, the best AK-47 skins, in my opinion. Some uh, Shattered Web stickers. More Shattered Web stickers. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Even more Shattered Web stickers. How many Shattered Web stickers does this guy have? It's a bunch of these torn SCAR-20 skins, some more Shattered Web stickers. So yeah, this inventory is just full of these Shattered Web stickers. So, I don't know, I don't think it's, it's not a very complete inventory. You do have a nice AK, and you have a pretty solid M4. So, it's kind of hard for me to give you a rating, because your inventory is kind of scarce. You have a bunch of stickers, though, which is nice. Um, if I were you, I'd probably hold on to these Shadow Web stickers. The next time they start to go up in price, I would sell them, get some money, and uh, reinvest it in in something more uh, more more worthwhile. Maybe save it up for the next major. Maybe invest in some operation skins during the next operation. We'll see. It's up to you. 
I'm probably going to give this inventory a 6 or a 7 just because it's pretty scarce, but nice AK-47. Nice AK-47. Alright, let's see. Who is next? Who is next? It's a pretty small inventory, Bonk Lord. Nice name. Uh, he has an AK-47 Asimov, uh, the Kushimov. I love that nickname. I think that's a great one. And uh, this combo doesn't look that bad, actually. I think it looks kind of cool, chat. What do you guys think? Hey, what's up, Sleepy? Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a fantastic day. We are reviewing some subscriber inventories today. Looking good, looking good. Opatheris. Evil Daimyo. M4A4. Looking really good. Solid stuff, solid stuff. I'd probably, let's see, what will I give this inventory? I'd probably give it a, it's very small. It's really hard for me to give you a rating when, when you barely have more than 10 skins. <laughs> so, I'd probably, it's tough. I'd probably give you a, a 6, just because you have some really cool expensive skins. I'd probably give you a 6 or a 7, but it's very, very, you should definitely start to expand this inventory. I would like to see more, more items in here. Thanks for sharing though, Bonk Lord. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, let's see here. Who is next in the queue? Hey, what's up, Falcon? How are you doing? I'm doing fantastic. How about yourself? When is the next CSGO major? Nobody knows. Nobody knows, man. Nobody knows. Oh, my dear Lord. What am I looking at, chat? What is this inventory? Jeez. Holy guacamole. Dang. Wow. Nice VP sticker. Very nice VP sticker. Jeez. Virtus Pro Hollows, Titan Hollows, a nice device gold sticker. That's really good. M4A4 Howl. Jeez. Let's, let's actually inspect this Howl real quick. Wow. Interesting. That's all I'm gonna that's all I'm gonna say. Nice name tag, dude. What <laughs> okay. Alright. Nice. That's an interesting way to, to uh to name your deagle. Uh really, really nice uh uh what what are these called? Really nice Cato 2015 hollows. You got three of these Titan hollows, a Vox Eminor, Navi Cato Hollow. Those are all really good stickers to be investing in. Um, really, really nice VP sticker. Natus Minsuri Dreamhack 2014 Cloud9 sticker. This guy seems to be investing in these OG expensive and desirable stickers, which, hey man, that, that's what you should be doing. That's that's awesome. We got an Akihabara Accept Factory New. Not too thrilled about some of these stickers, but hey, um, it's Factory New, so what do I know? That's really good. Marvin, welcome to the stream. Hello, hello. Skull Power, everybody. Um, welcome, Skull Power. Hello, hello. We have the flip side, Tactics, Cato 15 Hollow, more of them. Jeez, how many Cato's do you have? Nice Hydroponic Minimal Wear, probably low float if I were to bet. Yep, 0.078. Looking good. A nice Shroud Foil, Stewie 2K Foil. Just some more really old, expensive stickers. Very, very nice. Hello, hello everybody, for those of you tuning in, welcome to the stream. Nice case, Harden57. Nice, 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 nice. Let's see, what's the best AK skin under 150 euros? If you can get a hydroponic for under 150, that's that's really good, but I don't think it's possible. So, um, it's tough. It's tough to say what, what AK is the best. I'd probably take a look at, like, a Vulcan maybe, or, um, yeah, maybe a Vulcan might be good to take a look at. Nice stickers, man. This guy has a ton of stickers, a ton of these really nice looking OG tournament stickers from years gone by, and uh, very nice, very nice, nice dig stickers, some uh, some liquid hollows. Overall, just a really solid inventory uh, w uh, with sticker investments. Like these sticker investments are solid. Nicely done, man. Nicely done. I'm giving you a 10 out of 10. You got a really cool inventory. And, uh, I mean, you have a howl, so I have to give you a 10. If I were you, I'd get some gloves. 
after you've cashed out your your millions in a couple of years. <laughs> Nicely done, dude. Nicely done. All right, let's take a look at this next inventory. Let's see who is next in the queue. Let's see here, Mr. Matt. Let's see what's inside your inventory. Okay, that's awesome. Doesn't seem to work. I love it. Don't you just love it when things don't work? All right, let's try this again. Hopefully it works this time. We were going we were doing so well. Don't be like this steam. We were doing so well. We were on a win streak. No, it's not working chat. It was it was a matter of time. We we had a good run, boys. We had a good run. Um unfortunately, Matt, <laughs> it's not working. Um so, yeah, that's... Jeez. I feel like it's always critical, man. It's always critical. Ridiculous. In any event, chat, this is... This is very upsetting. QX, it is it is a little bit too late for me to take a look at your inventory, at least in the review channel. Um, you have to be one of the first people to submit it if you want me to take a look at it. But it looks like Steam is not working, which is lovely. So I can't review it um, the way I would have liked to review it. But this guy has 70 items. Doesn't have too much going on, but let's see what he's showcasing. He has an AK-47, whoops, an AK-47 Empress. He also has the Emperor. If you have the Empress, you should definitely try to get an Emperor. I think those are two really solid combos. He has an Op Neo Noir field tested. He has a Code Red Desert Eagle skin. Really nice. Really nice Covert Deagle. He has a MAC-10 Neon Rider. The Hyper Beast m 4 one s Minimal Wear. Commemoration from Moss in field tested condition as well as a Dragonfire SSG-08. Looking really good. It does look like it's time for Q&A, boys. Let's, uh, let's try a different inventory, but if it doesn't work, we'll probably just have to call it a day or start start doing some oh never mind okay a different inventory works this always happens sam it sucks but uh let's see here this inventory has some gloves it has the sports gloves bronze morph what do you guys think chat are you guys a fan of the the bronze morph this one's pretty battle scarred though so it doesn't look that that great but i think in low flow it looks better not bad not not bad gloves I don't think they're going for too much money. He has an interesting white themed inventory. Like all his skins have like this this bright, not really bright, but light light theme, I should say. Um, nice, nice, nice. A couple Azimovs, Tuxedo, Bamboo Forest, the stainless USPS skin with some dig dig stickers. These are from DreamHack 2014. They look really good. Nice. That's awesome. That's awesome stuff right there. He also has a butterfly knife stained, the fidget spinner. Interesting. Very nice. Butterfly knife stained, looking really good. He also has the AK-47. That's what she said. Oh, no. That is a... Oh, my lord. Ha, <laughs> Oh man, this is just beautiful. Jeez. QWERTY asks, any long-term investments? I really need something secure after losing 400 euros. Dang, that sucks, dude. I'd take a look at some Caddo 15 stickers if you can get a good deal on some of those hollows. Caddo 15 is really good. Um, Caddo 2019 hollows might also be an interesting opportunity. Um, yeah, definitely. Take a look at Cato 19 or Cato 15. Both are really good. Let's see here. AK-47 Vulcan. Nice. 50 Shades of Grey. Wow. All right. Let's take a look at this graphite. <laughs> Looking pretty good. If we keep going. Investments. He's 
He has this inventory storage unit with a bunch of investments. We don't know what's inside, but we can assume it's pretty good. Yo, nice Mr. Chief combo. Very nice. 10 out of 10 for me. Very, very solid stuff. Alright, so, I mean, you do have a butterfly knife, so I can't really give you a bad inventory review. And, I mean, you also have gloves. You have a pretty cool white-themed inventory, so... I'm probably going to give you a 10 just because you're pretty creative with these uh, with these skins. You have a knife, you have gloves, you have investments. You know what you're doing. Uh, Banana Boy, I'm giving you a 10 out of 10. Very solid stuff. Keep up the good work. Even your elite crew, even your agent has like this white light themed color going on. So overall, just solid, solid, solid stuff, dude. Solid stuff. Thanks for sharing. <clears throat> Let's take a look at this next inventory. Who is next? Let's try to get through some of these inventories. Okay, this guy is memeing, but that's alright. He has a USPS business class battle scarred. A very battle scarred business class. Wow. And then a bunch of these P250 sand dunes. Nice. And then just a random butterfly knife for SDD pat in the field tested condition. Because why not? Um, 10 out of 10? Question mark? <laughs> oh man, nice. Nice inventory, dude. Solid work. Solid work. Thanks for sharing, dude. Thank you. Let's see here. Who is next up on my list? get through this guy real quick Let's see 44 items only in his inventory which we cannot see thanks to valve and their player inventory problems lovely you hate to see it boys all right i guess we're gonna try a different inventory it might work some inventories work some don't who knows let's take a look at this guy's inventory he has a bunch of these um stat track csgo skins I think I've reviewed this inventory in the past. He has this really nice Team LDLC sticker from Cato 14. He has a couple other interesting CSGO skins. He has some other just random skins. I don't know. There's there's no theme here. But I'm, not, I'm not saying it's a bad inventory. I'm just saying like there's no theme. There needs to be some sort of theme, and I don't see one. Uh, let's see here. Glock 18 Water Elemental... The Aztec, that's a cool sticker. Rocket Pop. The Seasons, is there any interesting pattern on this? I don't think so. USPS Stainless. Bunch of these Agent Skins. We got the Phobos. Oh, this is the Low Float Phobos guy. Yeah, this is the Low Float Phobos guy. I feel like I reviewed this yesterday. Not bad. Agent to Ava. Yeah, not bad, not bad. I hope I give you the same rating. <laughs> That'd be kind of embarrassing, but uh, let's see. Yeah, this is a pretty nice sticker combo. The M4A1S Brightwater with some old Cologne 2014 stickers. Let's see. So I'd probably give this inventory, geez, maybe like an 8 out of 10. Just because you're missing knives and gloves. Not bad. Thanks for sharing, dude. Let's see. Who is next? Alright, this is already looking like a very promising inventory. Wow. The M4A1S Knight. Factory new, chat. Factory new. With three... <laughs> three crown foils. Dang. He also has an op Gongnir with the crown foil. Factory new. Jeez. The M4A4 Howl. Only field tested. Only. Low float. Very solid. He has a Desert Eagle Blaze. Wow. An M9 Ruby. Jeez. Easy stonks, boys. Let's get let's let's get some stonks in the chat. <laughs> nice butterfly knife fade. Looking really good. Wow, AK-47 case hardened. Nice. Nice blue on it too. Very nice blue. 
Jeez. He has another case hardened skin, this one being the 5 7. Ursus Knife. Phase 4, I believe. Looking really good. Wow. Let's see the fade on this Glock. Doesn't have the best fade. I probably would not have bought this Glock just because of how bad the fade is, but not bad, not bad. Talon Knife. Uh, Talon Knife, Factory New, looking good. Not enough pink for me, but hey. Still looks really good. It's still a Talon Knife. A nice Howling Dawn sticker. That's really cool. It's not every day you see it, chat. Not every day you see a Howling Dawn sticker. So, I think that's really cool. He has a Factory New P90 Emerald Dragon. He also has a Factory New Op Dragon Lore. Of course he does. Of course. Like, of course. Nice. Nicely done, dude. This is the dream. The dream skin. A nice Desert Eagle Prince Dream Factory New. Let's see what else. All his skins are like Factory New, which is just nuts. All of them are Factory New chat. All of them are Factory New, except for the Howl. <laughs> except for the Howl. Dang, go big or go home. Go big or go home. All these factory new skins. Minimal wear specialist gloves fade. Yeah. AK-47 Fire Serpent, not a factory new Fire Serpent. Interesting. A factory new Mjolnir, dude. Dang. Some trade-ups here. The Splash Jam, not factory new. Minimal wear, okay. The Akihabara Accept, field tested, not factory new. Okay. Interesting. Just some really good skins here. Overall, you got some really nice skins. This guy has a ton of really nice skins in his inventory. Like, jeez, all of them are factory new. He only has factory new skins. Look at all the factory new skins I just went through. Dang. Jeez. What? Wow. Wow. Nicely done, dude. Nicely done. Nice inventory. You know what you're doing. You obviously know what you're doing, and you got a really cool inventory. Thank you so much for sharing it, and uh, yeah, 10 out of 10. I think it's unanimous. All right, let's move on to the next inventory. I believe we're over here. Let's see. Whoops. That is a trade link. That's not... Did I just get scammed by Blaze? Does he have my Howl? <laughs> oh man, alright, so let's see here. In his inventory, he has a stat track op Phobos. Interesting combos, or sticker choices. He has the Tomcat stat track Aug skin. He seems to be building a yellow themed inventory. Not bad. Some nice yellow skins in here. Go to the next page. He has the Moto Gloves Transport in the well-worn condition. They don't look too bad. I kind of like them. I think they look pretty pretty solid with some scratches on. He has the Buzzkill M4A4. Very nice, very nice. Overall, this is a really cool inventory. I'd like to see you get a knife, though, so I'm probably going to give you an 8 out of 10. Maybe, okay, 9 out of 8 or 9 out of 10, just because you could improve. What's your AK? What's your AK skin? Do you have the fuel injector? I don't think you do. So, yeah, if, if you got the fuel injector, if you got a nice yellow knife, I'd probably give you a 10. But uh, I think it's an 8 just because you're missing those two key, key skins. All right, let's see here. Who is next? Let's see. Here we have a gut knife, autotronic in the field tested condition. <laughs> gotcha, Ruby. 
Nice. Nice name. AK-47, uh, AFK-47, <laughs> the Royal AK. Interesting, interesting. Very nice. Hyper Beast M4A1S, the Op Wildfire, the Operation Phoenix, very nice nickname, very creative. Creative nickname, I like it. Well, that looks really good. What else does he have? The Commemoration, Momentum, the Desert Eagle Mecha Industries, USPS Cortex. These are all these are all really good skins. Would definitely recommend. Max 7 Justice. Going to the next page. Some Blood Sports. Yeah, just overall looking really good. Overall, I I would definitely Yeah. Just a really nice, really nice inventory. I'd try to get some gloves if I were you. Um, you don't have the most expensive of in inventories, but you do have some really cool skins, some uh, some really high quality coverts. I would try to get a nice knife or a nice glove that goes with your Autotronic. So maybe maybe look at like the Crimson Weave. Maybe take a look at like the Crimson Web, and um, or actually since you have the Autotronic, it might look good the. Um, what are these gloves called? Let me. It's the Bloodhound gloves. The. Let's go here. I believe they are. The charred. I think these. Here you go. You can get you can get a nice field tested one. Um, you can either buy from the Steam Market or wherever you buy your skins from. And um, this might actually be a nice uh, knife to, or a glove to take a look at. It might look nice with your with your knife. Just just some some thoughts. And with some of your other skins, too. Alright, 8 out of t 9 out of... It's a small inventory. It's tough. It's in e it's either an 8 or a 9. It's kind of hard for me to rate it, because it's kind of small. But either way, thank you for sharing. Let's take a look at this next inventory. Alright, this guy, Rapid Nader. Wow. Nice showcase. Let's see what's inside. So we got Stat Trek from Os Valens. We got an Ursus Knife Slaughter. Let's take a look at the pattern. Mm, that's right. He knows. Nice pattern on it. Um, he also has <laughs> Kiss Me All Right, uh, AK-47 Aquamarine Revenge. Interesting name tag. Uh, the Avalanche Stat Trek. All these are Stat Trek. That's awesome. He has a Stat Trek M4A4 Hellfire. That's really good. Let's see here, the Empress, I better see an Emperor. Uh, we got the AK-47 Yon Rider, we have the Onitaji, looking really good. Very solid, solid stuff. If we go to the next page, he has the Red Laminate, the X-God Doja, yes! You're missing the Doja sticker though! <laughs> Where's the Doja foil? Hollow gold sticker, where are you? You're missing Doja's sticker, man. Come on. <laughs> not bad, not bad. Uh, let's see. He also has the Specialist Gloves Foundation. I used to really like these gloves. I always wanted one. Um, they're not bad. It's just... Uh, I think they look better in minimal wear, though. Just because some of these scra scratches don't look that, that good, in my opinion. But overall, I think these, these gloves are kind of cool. I still like them. And, uh, yeah, very nice, very nice. Uh, Containment Breach, AK-47 Case Hardened. Hey, what's up, uh, what's up, hee hee, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. We're just reviewing some subscriber inventories today. Nice AK-47 Case Hardened. We have a Glock 18 Fade. Let's take a look at its, uh, pattern. Very low fade. I probably would not have bought this Glock. Hopefully you didn't pay too much for it, but... Yeah, it's, it's just, the, the pattern isn't good. Uh, let's see here, Stat Trek, AK-47 Azimov, the AK-420 Blazin, Blaze It, I should say, not bad. Not bad at all. Looking, looking fresh, looking good. He has a Souvenir Chalice, that's interesting, although the stickers are scraped, which is kind of unfortunate, but... Hey, it's a Souvenir, it's still pretty good. What's up, Soa, how you doing? Chaos, welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing fantastic. Yeah, I know a lot of these rich people. There is the emperor. I knew I was going to find an emperor. Nice, nice, nice. Next page, we got 
Butterfly Knife Crimson Web in the field tested condition. Looking pretty good. And then he has a Falchion Knife Fade. Low Fade. I probably well actually not, not it's actually not that bad of a fade. Let's let's give it let's give it some credit. It's not too bad. Pretty solid, solid skin. We have the butter knife, the flip knife case hardened. Actually, it's not a butter knife. It looks like a butter knife, but here it's actually has a lot of blue on it. That's really cool. Hey, Shivalaya, thank you so much for the super chat. You asked me to take <laughs> that Death Come sticker off of my Desert Eagle Blaze. Please recommend some other sticker now. I have to remember, I think it was on the number three position? If I were you, I would put some sort of, like, incineration sticker, maybe a flammable sticker, maybe some sort of, um, I don't know, like, it could be anything, honestly. Just some, some sticker that looks good on the blaze. Maybe some yellow foil sticker, um, yeah, just, um, because you, you had some other hollows stickers that are red, so maybe consider placing... Another red hollow, maybe like a Tylu hollow or something. Um, let's see here, M9 Bayo Doppler. I need to get an M9. I just... M9s are going up in price, so... Definitely should try to get one. Uh, Scar 20 Emerald. Kamicho Dragon. Nice SK hollows on your Kamicho Dragon. I think those look really good. Very, very solid. Op Neo Noir. Stat Track, R8 Crimson Web. Player 2. Don't want to skip over anything. This is a Blackie Moth. Let's take a look at the float. Point ninety three. Interesting. I probably would not purchase a Blackie Moth unless it's like point ninety five and above, but that's that's just my opinion. I think it's still pretty good. He has the Sports Glove Superconductor. Pretty high float. They still look good, though. He also has a Karambit Tiger Tooth Factory new. Much respect. Very nice knife. And then, yeah, he just has some other really cool skins. Stat Track Blue Lamb. Stat Track Electric Hive. The Mecha Industries Field Tested. The M4A4 Dragon King. Overall, just really, really solid inventory. Thanks for sharing it, man. Oh, there's more, dude. Driver Gloves Imperial Plaid, dude. That's insane. Really nice. It's nice low float gloves. Who needs Pandora's box when you have these gloves? Look at that. That looks really good. And, uh, yeah, let's keep going. Icarus Fell, Blood in the Water, USPS Orion, the Whiteout. This is a nice combo right here. It's a really cool combo. Some more stat track skins. Just overall, very nice inventory. Got some nice Navi hollows on this skin. Wow. I'm g I, you, you know what I'm going to give you. I'm giving you a 10 out of 10. Looks really solid. Nice inventory, nice knives. Let's uh, take a look at the next inventory. Um, let's see here. Oops. Let's see who is next. All right, so this guy's opening cases, I see. Interesting. The point disarray with a bunch of gold web stickers. I probably would scrape them a little bit, but that's just me. Some nice weapons cases. Interesting. Did you buy them or did you uh, did you get them as a drop? That's pretty cool. Some more cases. Even more cases. Wow. This guy has a ton of cases. Interesting. Whoop. Ah, it's for the rat rod trade up. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. A bunch of Prisma cases. Some more. Another OG CSGO weapons case. That's interesting. Wow. Wow. Oh, 
Okay, all right. Not a bad inventory. It's kind of small because you have a ton of cases. So it doesn't... You don't have a lot of skins, but it's not bad. I'd probably give you a... You have you just have so many so many items. I'd probably give you like a seven, maybe an eight. Not bad, not bad. Keep up the good work. Nice job with the cases. I'd like to see you invest in the next major though. So whenever the next major comes out, I better see some stickers in here. Not bad. Let's take a look at the next inventory here. Mr. Radu. Let's see what you have in here. I knew there was going to be a nice sticker on this skin. Very nice. Very nice. Nice fanatic. Cato 14. Op Azimov. You mad, bro? We got a nice Desert, er, desert Eagle. Huh? SSG 08 Darkwater. Interesting. USPS kill confirmed. Red Quartz. The Supernova. Hey, what's going on, Kin Frags? Welcome to the stream, dude. Welcome, welcome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. As always, CSGO skin guy. Yep. Awesome, awesome, awesome. AK47 Vulcan with uh, some nice stickers. This, this actually looks better than I th thought it would. The m 4 Azimov. The Cobalt Disruption. Nice Tiger Tooth M9. Very, very solid. That deserves an awesome, awesome, awesome in the chat. Really good. And uh, yeah, just overall... Very, very solid knife. Would definitely recommend. I really am curious what's inside your stickers inventory storage unit, but that's okay. He even has this default AK with some old VP stickers. That's kind of cool. How you doing, Leor? Welcome to the stream. How is everybody doing? Roscoe, welcome, welcome. Storms, how you doing? I'm just reviewing some inventories today. Some subscriber inventories, I should say. And, uh, yeah, this inventory is not bad. You have a really nice knife. Um, I would like to see some gloves. I'm giving you a 9 out of 10, just because I would like to see some more investments in gloves. Alright, let's see. Who is next on the list? Let's see here. Very small inventory. We have an electric hive. Very nice um, dig sticker on the scope. We're looking really good. He has another electric hive. This time with a dream hack sticker on the scope. Interesting. Desert Eagle Crimson Web. M4A4 Dragon King. It's really hard for me to rate this inventory. I probably won't rate it because it's just way too small. Um, but overall, not bad. Looking pretty good. Not bad, not bad, Toxico. Not a bad inventory. I can't rate it, unfortunately, because it's way too small, but still looks pretty good. Let's see, who is next on the list hey now thank you so much for becoming a fano squad member now you joined at the right time my friend congratulations congratulations uh welcome to the fano squad can i get a fano squad in the chat for now welcome 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 and uh yeah uh make sure you join the discord server and uh yeah we're gonna get some nice benefits for you dude thank you all right let's see who is next Let's see, next inventory, Atticus. This guy has a purple-themed inventory, nice. Um, interesting graffitis. He has the discotheque, the enforcer. Let's see, what else does he have? He has the Op Fever Dream Minimal Wear, the Glock 18 Moonrise, some uh, nice Decimator-type skins like the Neon Rider, the Decimator M4A1S, the Decimator Tech 9, the Cortex, a bowl cut neutralizer. Nice nickname, my dude. Nice nickname. And, uh, yeah, just uh, really cool inventory overall. Just 
nice theme to it. I really like it. You should put more of these stickers, because they are pretty cheap. You should put more of them on your skins. Uh, overall, just really solid inventory, and uh, I like how you organized it for us. I think the organization deserves an extra point. I'm giving you a 9 out of 10. I think you got a pretty cool inventory. Keep up the good work. Very nice, very nice. Lucifer, I skipped you on Discord. I am sorry if I did. Did I? Huh. My apologies. I did skip you. Thank you for reminding me. Let's uh let's make sure I go back to Lucifer. I'm sorry. Let's take a look at his inventory. All right. This guy is another sticker investment guru. Look at this. He has wow. Just wow chat. That looks really good. That looks really good. He also has the Fever Dream with all these boost hollows. That looks also really good. Very flashy skin. He has the VP hollow, the Keed Stars hollow, and the 3D Max hollow. Very nice stickers. Some Tai Lu hollows, some Furia hollows from Cato 19. Really, really good. He has a Stat Track M for A1S Nightmare in the Minimum War condition. The Stat Trek Opatheris with a Fury Hollow. And he has the USPS Stat Trek Neo Noir with a bunch of these Greyhound Gaming Hollows. Also really good. So, uh, yeah, overall, just really nice inventory. I would say. I would say if I were you, at some point, you should cash out some of these stickers and try to, like, probably during the next major and reinvest. And then uh, try to get a knife. Try to get some gloves. Your inventory is very small. It's hard for me to give it a good rating, but I'd probably give it like an 8 or a 9. Just because of the investment value. Very nice. Thanks for sharing, Lucifer. Sorry I skipped you there. Oops. Let's see. Who is next on the list? The mighty list. Let's see here. This guy here has a bunch of these green CSGO skins. That's pretty cool. Krampus, welcome to the stream. How you doing? Is it 3 p.m. on your country, Phantom? No, it's currently 11.13 in the morning. Hello, hello, everybody, for those of you tuning in. What are inventory storage units, and why do you need one? They are extra space in your inventory. They allow you to organize your inventory better by placing items in there and then moving them in and out. They allow you to organize your stuff. They allow you to organize your inventory. Sunshine in a bag. That's interesting nickname for your storage unit. But anyways, moving right along, he has a containment breach with a drug war veteran sticker. I'm assuming it's on the scope. Yep, it is. Let's see here. What else? What else? Some really nice Snoop Dogg's trophy. That's awesome. Nice nickname. Nice nickname. Very nice collection here you got. The Desert Eagle Emerald with Jormungandr. Looking fresh. Conrad, you know what's up, you know what's up. Let's see, so we got the Cut Knife Kama Doppler. Very, very nice. Let's see, what else are we missing here? We got the Nuclear Garden. Looking good. Mac 10 Nuclear Garden. The Radiation Hazard with a Titan Cato 2014 sticker. That looks really good. Am I... Oh, wait. They, they, are they all 420 floats? Oh, they are. Hold on a second. Oh, wow. They're .042. Dang. That makes it even better. No. I completely skipped that. That makes it even better. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Ah, oh, well this one isn't. Boo. <laughs> and this one isn't either. Boo. <laughs> uh, let's take a look at these gloves. They are also not 420, but hey. They're still green, so we'll give it. We'll give it. Awesome stuff. Uh, let's take a look at this. Uh, Jaguar. It, it is a 420 Jaguar. It is. Interesting. 
interesting choice of sticker. Overall, it's not bad. If we keep going here, we got the flashback. I believe it's also... It's not 420. Come on. You're killing me, my dude. Uh, let's take a look at the briar. This one is a... 2-4. <laughs> okay. Nice. Let's see here. <laughs> Lit for 20. <laughs> nice nickname on your colony. Lit for 20. You got some pretty interesting, funny names. Oh man, some of you guys and your and your <clears throat> your nicknames are just too good. Too much fun. Nice, nicely done. Ooh, this guy has the Bravo coin. Nice. Alright, I'm giving you a 10 out of 10. You have some creative skins. You got a really cool inventory. Keep doing what you're doing, Sings. Thank you for sharing. Let's take a look at this next inventory. Let's see what else we got in here. Let's see. We got not a whole lot going on in here, but... We have the Moonrise, we have the Magnesium with some Berlin stickers. We also have the Firefight, the Op Mortis in the Field Tested Condition, Desert Eagle Light Rail. He has the Safari Mesh, the Bio Leak. Yeah, not bad. Some of these skins are pretty solid. I think your inventory is on the right track. I think you should definitely start investing in some cases. During the next CSGO Major, I would really like you to buy a couple capsules if you can afford them. Maybe sell a couple skins so that you can buy them. I think uh, you got to get started with some investments because your inventory isn't bad. And you're probably starting out, just now starting to trade. But I w um, if you really want this inventory to explode, you're definitely going to want to start investing. So, not bad, not bad. Um, keep up the good work, and, uh, watch my videos. I'll try my best to help you out as best I can. Uh, as for a rating, it's kind of hard. It is a pretty complete inventory, more or less. I'd probably give it a 7, maybe a 6 or a 7. It is kind of small, but 6 or a 7, you're on the right track. Alright, let's see, who is next? Let's see here. Let's take a look. Oh boy. Right off the bat I'm giving I'm giving you a 10. GG, well played. Nice butterfly knife. This is one of my favorite knives in CSGO. One of my favorite knives in CSGO. That's alright, Ken. That's fine. It's it's completely optional. It you don't have to feel sorry, man. Don't have to feel sorry at all. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. But this knife is just really good. Really, really nice. Like, oh, it's just so beautiful. It's just so beautiful. He has the sports gloves vice. Also looking pretty good. Desert Eagle Blaze. UMP Blaze. Akihabara except well worn. We got a Medusa well worn. The Meme Dusa. That's a really cool nickname on your Medusa. <laughs> the Meme Dusa. I like it. I like it. Huntsman Knife Case Hardened. Very nice blue on it. That's gorgeous right there. That's really good. Um, Kenny, you should have uh, posted your uh, inventory link in the Discord server uh, within the first 15 minutes of the stream. Uh, I, I, I'm closing it now early so that I can get through everybody in a video and this doesn't become a really long stream uh, because... I want to save my voice. I also don't want people to get frustrated at the end. So you got to make sure you're one of the first people to submit your inventories if you want to participate. Uh, AK-47 case hardened. Nice sticker. I think it goes well with the case hardened. Let's see what else. Another case hardened 5.7. Old blue. I like it. Some of these nicknames are just way too funny. 
Some of these nicknames are way too funny. You guys are killing me with these nicknames. What? <laughs> okay, he has a howl. I was about to skip over a howl, chat. Jeez, I completely missed this uh, low flow field tested howl. Wow. I was gonna skip it. That's crazy, chat. I know, right? <laughs> How did I skip this howl? Jeez. What am I doing? It's been a long morning, alright? Leave me alone. <laughs> nice uh, Glock 18 fade. Low fade, though, but hey, it's still a Glock 18 fade nonetheless. Overall, you got a really cool inventory. I'm going to give you a 10 out of 10. And uh, yeah, just keep doing what you're doing. Backup items. I like it. I like it. Alright, let's see who is next here in this Discord server. Alright, right off the bat, I see some Bloodhound Gloves Gorilla. Hey, what's up, Ohm? Welcome to the stream. How you doing? These are some nice gloves. And then he also has the Flip Knife Black Laminate to go along with them. I think that's a pretty cool combo. Copenhagen Wolves. Interesting. Interesting choice for your stickers. It's not bad. Not bad. It's morning for Fano, but it's night for me. Yep, that's the way the world works. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, we got the Jet Set, the Flom Jam, interesting name. Adren, interesting stickers. Clock 18 Reactor Souvenir, Chantico's Fire, Field Tested Stat Track, the Business Class Factory New. That looks pretty cool. The Op Azimov, Desert Eagle Naga, M for a S. Okay, so not not bad. Dick Stacy foils. Okay, so he's collecting Dick Stacy foils. That's pretty cool. All right, not bad, not bad. Hello, how is your day? My day's going fantastic. How's your day? How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. I'm reviewing inventories at the moment. Subscriber inventories. Ooh, ooh, this guy, this guy copied me. Yo, that's awesome, man. This guy also has the same. The same combo from one of my videos. That's awesome. You know, I love to see it. I love it when, when I see inventories from you guys and you guys have the sticker combos that I suggested. That looks really cool. Congrats, man. That's awesome that you actually used it. I, I really like this. He even... This is, like, identical to the one in my video. Wow. Just wow. Just, well, just for that, you deserve a 10. All right, let's see. 10 out of 10 from me to you. Nicely done. Let's see, who is next? What's up, Sergey? Welcome to the stream, bro. Let's see. Let's see who is next. What's in this inventory? We got the Op Wildfire. We have the Fuel Injector, JW style. I like it. We have the Buzzkill M4A4. Bulldozer. Bulldozer. Why did he nickname it the Bulldozer? Interesting. Zaiwu, okay. We got some shattered web cases. Not bad. Some Berlin stickers, some more cases. Okay, so not bad. Not a bad inventory. Kind of small, so it's kind of hard for me to give you a good rating. Uh, you do have some nice skins, like some nice uh, commonly used skins or whatever. Um, I would probably give you an 8 out of 10 just because you're missing a knife, you're missing some gloves. Happy birthday, Babouche. Happy birthday, man. Make sure you join my Discord server if you want to do any of those challenges. That's the best way to contact me for for uh, for stuff re regarding challenges. Ooh, I was about to skip over this detour. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. 
This actually looks pretty cool. Not gonna lie. All right, so uh, ooh, he also has a red line with these hollows. It's pretty battle skirt, isn't it? Yep. Okay. Interesting. All right, let's move on to the next inventory. Let's go here. Let's see, where are we? Let's see here. Um, if it loads and it doesn't look like it's gonna load, of course. I knew this was gonna happen. Let's take a look at Laura's inventory. He's after this guy. Let's see what's inside. Only 10 skins, so this guy has a Gamma 2 case. Very nice. He probably got it as a drop. That's a pretty uncommon drop these days. He has a Nova case Candy Apple minimum wear. He has the Sacrifice Clock 18, the Carnivore, um, SSG08, uh, Necropos, blah, 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 Torque, High Beam, Exposure, and a Buster Sticker. Okay. All right. Not bad, not a bad inventory, you're getting there. Um, I can't give you a rating, but it's because it's very small, but I would say, I would say, yeah, just uh, keep doing what you're doing, man. Keep playing CSGO, get those case drops, uh, collect those cases. You might get lucky with a couple skin drops. Uh, watch my videos, uh, join giveaways, I, I don't know what else to tell you, but, uh, and then during the next major, start taking a look at some investments because uh, let's get this inventory up and running. All right, let's see here, who is next? Let's see, let's take a look at this inventory. Let's see here, so this guy here has an M9 Bayo. Got some good pink on it, very nice. Very, very solid. Yo, thanks for stopping by T23, welcome. Welcome, you're you're welcome, man. You are very welcome. Let's see here. This uh, this actually looks not as good as I thought it would look. Chat, I thought this would look better. I'm sure it looks good in game, but I don't know. These these definitely do uh, bruise pretty easily. He has a bunch of these capillaries. Interesting. A bunch of these capillaries. Are you doing like trade ups? Or are these like some sort of investments? That's kind of cool. Ooh, he has a Huntsman Knife Knight. That's really nice. That's pretty cool. He has some Berlin capsules, Berlin 2019 capsules, a viewer pass as well. He has a package from Vertigo, signed by, I believe, Dupree. Not bad. Not bad at all. Wow. Just wow. He has a bunch of these old cases as well. Nice. This combo might not look that bad. When am I opening the next Bravo case? I'll probably do another case opening stream next week. So stay tuned for that. Probably going to be opening more cases next week. Let's see here. Uh, we got the candy apple. This actually, this combo doesn't look too bad. Ooh, he has the phase combos. These look pretty good. If you guys are building a nice red inventory, the Evil Daimyo face stickers look really good. They also look good on a red line too. Very, very good. Alright, so yeah, not a bad inventory. I would say you should try to get some gloves, because I don't see any gloves in your inventory. But uh, yeah, not bad, not bad. I'd probably give you a 9 out of 10 just because you're missing gloves. You're on the right track. You got some cool skins. Got some cool knives. So yeah, just uh, keep watching my videos and uh, start investing, you know, during the next, um, not operation, during the next major. Just uh, follow my guides and you'll be good to go. All right, let's see. Who is next up here? Whoops. 
All right, let's see here. He has a butterfly knife marble fade. Looking good. He has the specialist gloves crimson kimono. Also pretty nice float on them. Uh, Doin, the uh, inventory re review channel opens right when I start streaming, and it closes 15 minutes after I start streaming, so that I don't have a thousand <laughs> inventories to review in this stream, just to keep things a little bit organized. Uh, nice flip knife, by the way. Very nice flip knife. Very nice flip knife. Gorgeous flip knife, actually. Tanish, I have $6 in my account. What AK should I buy? Try to go for like a rat rod if you can. I think that's a good AK for around $6. Um, yeah. Desert Eagle Emerald Jormungandr. Let's see if it has a cool pattern. I don't think it does. Still not a bad skin. Next page. Op Azimov, Bish Bash Bosh. Or Bosh Bish Bash. Interesting. Interesting way of putting it. Case hardened stat track. A lot of blue on the back. The Empress combo. I'm trying to get through as many inventories as I can. There are a lot of them, yeah. Not bad, not bad. Got some souvenirs. Ooh, got some old Caddo 15 stickers. Nice. Not bad. Although you're placing them on default skins, so I don't know what you were thinking, but hey, to each his own. I think this knife is the star of your show. I think this knife is really good. Very nice knife. I'm going to give this inventory a 10 out of 10 just because... Oh, I missed the Fire Serpent too. Jeez. Nice Fire Serpent as well. And then also a Asimov as well. Cool. 10 out of 10, dude. 10 out of 10 for me to you. Let's see. Who is next? Let's take a look at... I love Olives. He has an Op Mortis. He also has... This is a Panther. Nice. The Jaguar. AK-47. He also has Stat Trek M4A4 Magnesium. And then uh, just a bunch of graffitis and other miscellaneous skins. Okay, so not bad. Uh, yeah, yeah. I would uh, try to get some more cases, try to invest in some cheap cases, and you'll be good to go. That's all I can tell you. Your inventory is kind of small, so it's hard for me to give you a good rating. I'd probably give you a 6 at the moment, maybe a 7, just because you do have a nice covert AK skin. Let's see, who is next? This guy here has an AUG radiation hazard. Blue lamb with a complexity 2014 sticker. Is it scraped or is it just me? I think it's scraped. Hmm. In any event. USPS Cortex, a couple other skins he probably unboxed. Not the biggest inventory, so it's hard for me to give you a rating, <clears throat> as my voice is just dying today, chat. I apologize. Uh, Op Phobos, Minimal Wear. It's kind of hard for me to give a rating. I'd probably give it a 6 or a 7. Um, nice nice Caddo Hollow, or Caddo sticker, I should say. Let's keep going. Yeah, my voice is just <laughs> dying today. Jeez. Jesus, all right, so what do we got here? Bunch of cases, cases and graffitis, a nice empress, cobalt disruption with a nice luminosity foil. You should put more luminosity foils, that's my my, my opinion. Um, SSGOA Dragonfire, some NACL, some more cases, even more cases and skins. Not bad, not bad. Not bad, Apotheris. Yeah, just overall, really, really cool, cool inventory. 
I think you're on the right track. I think you're on the right track. You'll probably get a knife soon. Probably next year, you'll get a knife. Yeah. Nice breakout cases, too. Hold on to them. Alright, let's see. Who is next? Let's see. Um, we got a butterfly knife, blue steel. That's really cool. Wow. All right. Yeah, one of the one of the nicer, cheaper butterfly knives out there. Also has a bunch of these souvenir sand dunes. AK forty seven emerald pinstripe with some nice hollow stickers on it. The blood sport, the bullet rain. Let's see this combo. Interesting sticker combo. Mac 10 Neon Rider, the Worm God. Battle Scarred Opsifire Mesh. And uh yeah, just a nice Orion. Not a bad inventory. Hidden stash. <laughs> I wonder what's inside your hidden stash. Um I didn't give you a rating. Um shoot. Yeah, I mean I thought I did. Um, my bad. Um, you are missing a knife. I'm giving you an A. Like you should know what the rating I I give. I usually am pretty consistent with my ratings. I think an eight is fine. You are missing knife and gloves, and you do have some pretty cool cases and skins. So I'm giving you an eight out of ten. Uh, sorry that I skipped over your rating. Uh, but let's see here. This butterfly knife, that's really good. Got some nice skins here. Oh, oh, Jesus, I was about to skip over this red line. Wow, he has an eye by power hollow chat. It's not on the scope, though, but still looking really good. Arne, welcome to the stream. How you doing? I'm reviewing some subscriber inventories right now. This is a really nice eye by power combo. Um, he has a nice nuclear threat. I'm giving this uh, inventory a 9 out of 10. 8 or 9, it's tough. It's kind of small, but hey, he does have some pretty cool expensive skins. So, uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's keep going to the next person on the list. He has the Empress, the Queen. I like the nickname. He also has... Jeez... Nice nickname. Um, a Theris, a bunch of graffitis, and a bunch of graffitis. Very small inventory. Hard for me to give you a solid rating. So uh, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to skip your rating because it's very small inventory. But I would, if I were you, I'd try to collect some cases. Try to maybe during the next major start investing, and uh, yeah, just uh, start trading. You know, trade some of trade some of your skins. Keep trading, and you'll be good to go. All right, let's take a look at the next inventory here. Bunch of cases, couple London 2018 Legends autograph capsules. Should we be investing in them? Maybe, I don't know. That's kind of cool. Some Dragon Lore foils, that's pretty nice. Cato 19 Legends autograph capsules, some Shattered Web, whoops. Apologize for that. Uh, we got the Op Onitaji. In the field test condition, unfortunately, if you guys are investing in Onitajis, I'd probably go with minimal wear and above. Um, I am reading your chat, high voltage. I'll try to remember to go back to you. I'm sorry. Um, but uh, let's try to get through a bunch of these. Gamma 2 cases, uh, Dragonfire. I'll review yours next. How about that? So that I don't forget couple spectrum cases, clutch cases, a bunch of clutch cases, horizon cases, all really good cases to be investing in right now as they are pretty cheap and uh, you'll definitely make profit in the long term. Uh, really, really good. Just really, really solid. All right, so I'd probably give this inventory an 8 out of 10, maybe a 7 or an 8. Um, 7, probably a 7 is the fairest thing to give, but not bad. Not bad at all. Let's take a look at high voltages inventory. Make sure I remember where my place was. Okay. Let's go back to high voltage because his inventory did not work. 
So let's see here. Give me one second. This inventory also didn't work. Whoops. Okay. All right, let's take a look at this inventory, high voltage. So you got the Cortex, uh, really, really good. You have an Evil Daimyo, that's awesome, minimal wear. Big Iron, well-worn, very nice. A Roll Cage Battle Scarred, interesting, interesting choice. Battle Scarred, it still looks pretty good, I bet. Golden Coil Battle Scarred, all of your skins are, like, you have a ton of these Battle Scarred skins. Is that on purpose? That's pretty cool. I would have gone with a Battle Scarred Imperial Dragon if I were you, but... Hey, field tested is fine as well. Let's see. Glock 18 Water Elemental. Not bad, not bad. The Traquois, Stat Track Classic Crate, some cases, Op Phobos. I like this sticker on it. I think it looks really cool. Not bad. Yeah, not bad at all. Not bad at all. Interesting stickers. You have some really interesting sticker uh, combos that you've made. Not bad. Um, yeah, if I were you, I'd try to get more cases uh, from now until the next major. Try Definitely try to invest in some cheap cases, and uh, you'll be good to go. I'd probably give you a 7 out of 10. Although it could be a very low 8. It's very close. 7 or an 8. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's take a look at this inventory that I skipped also. Doesn't have too many solid skins. Uh, uh, he does have a Phobos. That's pretty solid. He has the Magnesium. A uh, very interesting skin. Uh, Elite Build Battle Scarred. Anything else in here? Nothing too spectacular. Just a bunch of these skins that he either unboxed or got in drops. Yeah, buy your skins, boys. Don't unbox. It's never worth it until you get a knife. <laughs> Let's see. All right, so I this is a small inventory. I can't really give you a good rating. Probably a six, but uh, let's keep going. I want to get through all of these today if I can. You guys are nuts. So many, so many inventories. My voice is dying. Come on. All right, okay, well, this inventory doesn't work, so we're going to skip it. Let's see this inventory. Hopefully it works. All right, it does. Bunch of cases, bunch of agents. Nothing too spectacular on the first page. Bunch of cases, some Vanguard cases. That's interesting. A twist gold sticker. That's cool. Not bad. This guy has a ton of stat track skins. Awesome. Some shattered web cases, some CS20 cases. Not bad, not bad. I'd probably gosh, what am I gonna give this inventory? It's it's a tough one to to, to give. Maybe like a seven. Yeah, definitely cash out some of these cases before the next major. But we don't know when that is, so who knows at this point? Who knows? Alright, let's see. Who is next? Let's see here. And you guys, feel free to disagree with me on these ratings. Like, you guys can rate them in the comments and give me your your thoughts. I'd love to read what you guys think. Um, like, I'm just I'm just giving you my opinion. But again, if you guys rate an inventory higher or lower, let me know in the comments or in, in the chat, I should say. Um, whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. All right, so we have an Op Cortezera with a nice Cloud Nine Hollow from 2015. A very nice sticker going up in price. We have a nice G2 sticker on this one. This is a really nice sticker. Also a good Shroud um, MLG Columbus sticker as well. Some other nice stickers. Simple, Valde. 
Nice Fnatic Hollow. Mana War. Whoops. MBK. Res. This guy seems to be a Ninjas in Pajamas fan. Looking good. Alright, so I'm probably gonna attack 420. I'm probably gonna give uh, this inventory a solid 7 or an 8. I, I really don't know. Like, some of these are really close. 7.5? Maybe a seven. Let's see who is next. Let's see. So we have a sticker. We have a Tylu sticker. That's pretty cool. What else we got? We got two ops, interesting. An op Phobos. This is a really nice skin. I would use this skin. This is a really nice minimum wear combo with the Fnatic stickers. Uh, M4A4 for for Griffin. Pretty underrated skin. We have a blue laminate with some nice CLG stickers. Looking good. So, let's see. What else? What else? Looks like that looks like it's it. So I'd probably give this inventory like a six. I think it's a solid six. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's see here. Who is next? All right, this guy wants to trade. That's not. That's not what I. All right. Let's go here. This inventory is very small. Very tiny inventory. Okay, so inventories like this, I can't give you a, a, a rating because it's just not fair. So, Apotheris, that's a nice skin. The Naga, that's awesome. The Grim, the P MP9 Goo, and the Lead Conduit. Not bad. Nice job on the Eurotheris, though. Nicely done. That's a nice skin right there. Alright, let's see. Who is next? Tyloo or Phase or Mouse stickers. Um, it really depends on like the tournament. It also depends on the hollows, whether or not they're hollows. Some stickers look better than others, so it really depends. What kind of like craft are you trying to make, Codfishy? All right, let's see here. This guy here has an op boom minimal wear. He also has these Cato 2019 minor challengers or. Yeah, just sticker capsules. I wonder how long you're planning on holding them, holding on to them. He has an op red line with the Splice MLG Columbus 2016 sticker, I'm guessing, on the scope. Yep. He has another red line with a Navi sticker. This is stat track. No, it is not. Let's see what else. Uh, broke purple. Some more cases in here. And, uh,. Let's see, some more cases actually, just a ton of these cases. Wow, this guy has a ton of cases he's been investing. Cortex, M4 Desolate Space, and then just some Stat Track skins in here with some miscellaneous stickers, not bad. Yeah, I'd probably give this inventory a solid 7. Just because, I mean, you do have a really cool boom. Got some cool skins here, not decent investments, pretty good. So, let's do that. Alright, let's see, what is next? Who Who is next, I should say? Who are we going to take a look at next? Whoops, that's... Okay, cool. M9 Bayo Doppler, chat. This guy has an M9 Bayo Doppler, nice pink on it, pretty good distribution. Not bad at all. M9, like, any M9 is a very good knife. Uh, we got, oh gosh, Aquamarine Revenge. Interesting sticker combo. And, uh, let's see here. 
Danny, I'm going to be making a video on that today, so or tomorrow it'll come out, so I'll let you know tomorrow, Danny, but I'd probably hold at the moment. Uh, let's see here. Black Sand, Runic. Grim. Some of these some of these were probably unboxed. Nice revolver fade though. Looks pretty good. The speed demon. <laughs> Ooh, a nice Cato 14 sticker. Two of them actually nice. That looks good. I gotta make sure I don't skip any nice stickers. Hopefully I don't miss anything. Wow, 69. Jeez. I got trolled right there. Yo, Acid, coming in with the super chat. Thank you, my good sir. Absolutely, I'll take a look at your inventory. Absolutely. We're gonna take a look at yours next after this guy right here. Yeah, just overall, really cool. Man, this guy's inventory is just all over the place. He has all these really random skins that have some pretty cool stickers on it on them. Yeah, overall, really good. Really good. Nice. Nicely done. Let's see, what else do we have? Alright, not bad, not bad. Hopefully I don't skip anything. I know there's... This inventory is just all over the place. You guys should really organize your inventories better. Some of you guys. Not, not everyone. <laughs> $1,500 wasted. Nice. Nice name. Well, I'm probably going to give this a solid 9 out of 10, just because it has a really cool knife. You are missing gloves, but... Let's see here. Let's take a look at this next inventory. This guy has a Gongnir? No way. Uh, let's see here. Tribute to Skadoodle. Alright, this Azimov. Nice. Very nice Azimov. Couple cases. We got the AK-47 Azimov. Looks really good as well. Yo, Fabian Jansen coming in with the Fano Squad membership. Thank you so much for becoming a Fano Squad member. You joined at the right time, my dude. Big things on the way. Thank you so much for the support. Can I get a Fano Squad in the chat for Fabian? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome. Alright, let's keep going here. We got the SSG-08 Dragonfire. Um, let's see here. We have the MP7 Bloodsport in the minimal war condition. Very nice indeed. Alright, not a bad inventory. Not a bad inventory. I'd probably give it a solid 7. Just because you got some pretty cool... Some pretty cool expensive skins in here. Solid seven, I do say so myself. Fabian, I will take a look at your inventory. Absolutely, my dude. Here, let me take a look at your ID. Let me grab it real quick. I'll take a look at it, yeah. Let's, uh, let me just... Hold on. All these guys have IDs. Inventory is still not working. Give me one second. Profiles, I think it's called. Alright, let's take a look at his inventory. So, <clears throat> he has, right off the bat, I see a butterfly knife rust coat. That's pretty cool. I think that's really nice. Um, battle scar, let's see the float on it. Pretty nice float. He also has a flip knife tiger tooth. Very nice flip knife. Very, very solid. Um, I definitely think flip knives with Tiger Tooth look really good. He has stat track luck 18 water elemental, a nice new noir, my eye. <laughs> Very nice nickname. He has the overtake gloves, pretty solid gloves. They're not too expensive, so if you guys are interested in cheaper gloves, I think overtake is a good option. Nice buzz kill, sticker combo. He has the fuel injector in the um, 
battle scar condition with uh, with the CS twentieth. These foils are really uh, cheap comparatively, and they look really good. Let's see, anything else in this inventory? Not bad, not bad. You got some really nice pinks in here. Really nice pinks. And uh, some Bloodsport skins. Yeah, overall, you got you got some pretty nice looking skins in here. If I were to rate your inventory, I'd probably give it a solid... Yeah, I think it's a solid 10. You have a really cool butterfly knife. Got some nice knives. You're on the right track, dude. You're on the right track. Start investing. Um, okay, here, here are your investments. We don't know what's inside, but I imagine it's something good. And uh, yeah, I'd love to see where this inventory goes. Maybe upgrade your gloves at some point. But uh, overall, it looks really good. Thank you so much for becoming a member. Welcome to the squad again. And I uh, hope you have a great rest of your day. Let's see who is next here. Gosh, did I lose my did I lose my spot? Oh man, hopefully. Wait a second. Oh jeez, hopefully I didn't skip anybody. Let's take a look at this next guy, Kevin, coming in with the one dollar super chat. Thank you so much, my dude. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, yeah, much appreciated for the super chat. All right, this guy has a bunch of these green CSGO skins. Uh, so he has the Empire, the Fuel Rod, the Limelight. These are all not too common or too popular skins, but they are green. So props to you for building a themed inventory. I love looking at themed inventories. Let's see. AK-47 Emerald Pinstripe, Moss Quartz, the Chameleon. Very nice as well. Next page, more green CSGO skins. Just more green CSCO skins. Um, very, very nice. Let's see. So, anything else? We got some Gamma 2 cases, a bunch of Gamma 2 cases, CS20 cases, Spectrum cases, a bunch of these Agent skins. Okay, he's investing in Agent skins. Interesting. Prisma cases. Keep going. Some Shattered Web stuff. Some more, some more cases. Man, this guy just has a ton of cases. This guy is investing a lot in cases so it's kind of hard for, for me to give you a rating just because you have so many cases and I don't see too many skins and knives but I'd probably give it a solid 7 out of 10 just because or maybe a 7 or an 8 you got some pretty cool stuff going on in here hey Luis Escobar thank you so much for the super chat my friend thank you thank you thank you please rate my inventory absolutely I'll rate your inventory thanks so much for donating and supporting the channel Let's take a look at your inventory next. Let's see here. Let's see what's inside. Shivalaya. I unboxed a flip knife Damascus steel field tested. Why are you sad? Thank you so much for the super chat, my dude. Thank you. But why are you sad? That's a good knife. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, Let's take a look at this inventory. So, let's see here. We got a Desert Eagle Blaze Factory New with the Chi Bomb. We have a really cool knife, the Bayonet Gamma Doppler. This knife actually... Gamma Dopplers are really interesting knives. You guys should definitely be taking a look at. I think they have potential. They're pretty, pretty solid. I think they're, they're pretty desirable. Hey, what's up, Joshua? Welcome to the stream. How you doing? A knife is a knife, LMAO. Absolutely it is. This guy here has a Karamid Doppler. Really nice... Really nice, ooh, ooh, very nice pattern on it. Sun in Leo, AK, or AK-47 AWP, he has the Shadow Daggers Urban Mast. They don't look too hot, but a knife's a knife, as we all say. Uh, Op Asimov, M4A4 Asimov, looking pretty good. And uh, yeah, he has some gloves, the Hydra Gloves Rattler in the field testing condition. If you guys are looking for some cheaper gloves, definitely take a look at some of the Hydra gloves, some of the Bloodhound gloves. Those are pretty cheap and uh, they have potential. We have a nice Ty Luke sticker combo on this Stat Track Redline. Also looking fresh. And uh, USPS Orion. Nice sticker combo here. We go to the next page, even more CSGO knives. He has a Butterfly Knife Scorched, a very nice Butterfly Knife, Low Float Scorched too, very solid. His Glock, did I skip over a Glock? Where is this? Okay, yes, absolutely, I missed this Glock. Wow, he does have a nice um, Team LDLC Cato 14 Glock 18. 
Oh, that's a mouthful. Sticker combo, very nice, very solid. Uh, Glock 18 nonetheless. Next page, like I said, he has a bunch of more knives. Felcha knife, rust coat. Very, very solid. We have a headshot machine, AK-47. How many red lines do you have, my dude? He has the Emperor. I already know where the sticker is placed. Yep. He has the Bloodsport. Kind of bummed that you don't have an Empress. I feel like since you have the Emperor, you should go with the Empress. But hey, the Bloodsport is also a really cool knife. Or knife, AK skin. Um... And, uh, yeah, just, if we just keep going, like, yeah, these are some really cool skins you got. Azimov, another Orion. Next page, we got even more knives. How many knives do you have? Talon knife stained. He also has the classic knife, Boreal Forest. Dang. Looking really good. Uh, <laughs> the Hellfire, interesting name there. A nice VP combo on your Azimov. That's really cool as well. Some more stat track CSGO skins, some agent skins. Overall, this inventory is pretty nuts. And he has even more knives. What am I looking at, chat? He has some more Hydro Gloves, but uh, he also has the Butterfly Knife for SDD Pat. He has a Classic Knife Slaughter. I'm a huge fan of the Classic Knife, and I think Slaughter looks really good on it. AK-47 Fuel Injector. That's a really nice combo right there, chat. That looks really good. Uh, 10 out of 10 for that, and uh, the next, yeah, just <laughs> cut knife autotronic, flip knife Damascus steel, butterfly knife stained, here is the empress, there we go, I knew you had to have an empress, there we go, uh, some nice gloves, driver convoy, if you guys are looking for some cheap gloves, these gloves are also really good, you should definitely take a look at. Yeah, just overall, really, really nice inventory. You got a couple repeat skins, which are which is interesting why you have repeats, but nonetheless, let's keep going to the next page. A flip knife, a stat track flip knife tiger tooth. Jeez, nice. This is stat track, my friends. Very, very solid stuff. And uh, yeah, another rust coat. All my money. Another rust coat falchion knife. Do you think a USPS kill confirmed? With a 0.66, six three sixes float would be worth overpay. Depends on how much overpay. Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Uh, he has a bunch of these lambda hollows and another butterfly knife. This time rust coat. He has some more stat track skins. Very nice as well. This combo might look pretty decent in game. Next page, oh, more knives, an Ursus knife rust coat, some more stat track skins. Jesus, how many? Your inventory is, is just massive. Some more repeat skins. Some more knives. Wow. This guy just has a ton of knives. Nice pink on this uh, Ursus knife. Very, very solid. Wow, he has an M9 Bayo. That's awesome. That's really cool. Hats off to you, man. Very nice inventory. How many empresses do you have? How many knives do you have? Stat Trek M9 Rust Coat. He also has an M9 Black Laminate. A Falchion Knife for his DD Pat. Another Butterfly Knife Urban Mask this time. Jeez. Doesn't end. Another Stat Trek Red Line this time with I Buy Power. Wow. Just wow. That's, I mean, I don't know what else to say, it's a, except you got some really cool skins in here, my dude. And it gets even better, I guess. More, more gloves, more knives, the flip knife lure. Looking really good. More gloves, more knives, M9s, classic knife. Desert Eagle Blaze. This Electric Hive has some really cool Cato 14 stickers. Very solid indeed. If we go to the next... Oh my gosh, how many knives do you have, my dude? You got way too many knives. You're killing me. 
<laughs> Shivalaya says, why not get some high tier skins, bruh? Trade repeats. Yeah, there are a lot of repeats in, in this inventory. Bayonet Rust Coat behind you, bro. Stained Ursus Knife. Some more AK-47 red lines. Jeez. Wow. Just well. I bought this drunk. <laughs> that summarizes this inventory in a nutshell, my dude. Nice. Nice karambit. Uh, nice gloves, too. Pretty l Oh, low float, too. Low float, well worn. I like it. Desert Eagle, Emerald Jormungandr. Karambit. The Silver Surfer. I like that nickname on your Karambit Damascus Steel. Some more knives. How many knives does this guy have? Nomad knife. <laughs> Did you unbox them? Did you buy them? Like, what? That's nuts, dude. You're nuts. Just nuts. M9 Bayonet Gamma Doppler. <laughs> D's nuts, absolutely. That's fitting. Wow. More knives, boys. More knives. Bayonet Plus Steel. Uh, battle Scarred, this one's Minimal Wear, another Rust Coat, or no, this is Case Hardened. <laughs> case Hardened Butterfly Knife. He's a collector, I guess? I mean, yeah. I guess he is. Hydroponic Minimal Wear, really nice, really nice sticker combo on this Hydroponic. More gloves, more knives. Wow. Just wow. Yeah, this guy just collects a bunch of skins. At this point, like, nothing can really surprise me. Although, if I were you, my dude, I would take some of those knives and just sell them and get a bunch of money and buy a Dragon Lore, buy a Gungnir, buy buy some some more expensive skins. You know, like these knives are all great, but I would I would spend more money on like those higher high tier skins. Um, and then here he has a bunch of these storage units for investments, I suppose. I guess there you go, chat. You guys want an inventory like his? Look, this is why he has such a big inventory. Look at that. Look at all these investments that he has. He's been investing over the years. That's how you uh that's how you make a lot of money and you can afford all these expensive knives. Really really solid. Yo, haha -ha gagger, thank you so much for the $5 super chat, you beautiful person. You my inventory is trash, but would you check it out anyways? Absolutely, I'll check it out. Thank you so much for the super chat. I'll check it out after this inventory. Um yeah, let's jeez. All right, so let's keep going. Four crown foils on this red line. Nicely done. And uh yeah, just gorgeous. Some more red lines. Some more gloves. Got knife gamma dopplers. Atlanta 2017. He's invested in every major. And that's why his inventory is so good. Got some really nice skins in here. Really nice skins. Wow. Crack cow. Wow. There is his howl. He has a stat track field tested howl chat. 
Dang. Nicely done. He's trolling you, Fano? <laughs> Alright. I haven't gotten to him yet. We'll see we'll see if he's if he's trolling me, but this we still need to get through this guy. I feel like everybody is trolling me today. All these guys that are donating super chats, y'all are trolls. Stop flexing, alright? We get it. You guys have good inventories, alright? You don't have to flex. Or you do, I mean it's completely up to you, but dang, Krakow or no, Katowice 2019, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Nicely done, man. Nice inventory. Overall, how many knives is that? How many knives? At least 75 knives. This guy has at least 75 CSGO knives. Probably more. And, uh, how many gloves does he have? Wow. That's solid. He has, uh, 16, 17 gloves. That's... Nice inventory. Very nice inventory. What can I say? Just really good. Nice inventory. Thank you so much for the super chat. Alright, let's take a look at this next inventory that I promised to take a look at. Alright, let's see his inventory. We go here, and just like that, he has a Sapphire, M9 Doppler, of course he does. Of course he does. How much is this, how much is this knife going? I bet this knife is worth more than my inventory. Jesus. He also has a Karambit Ruby, which is also going for a, a shit ton of money. Um, he also has a Minimalware Howl, low float too. A dragon lure with a crown foil. Factory new. Medusa, well worn with a crown foil. Factory new fire serpent. A hot rod with a bunch of these, <laughs> these global elite foils. Damn. Wow. Jeez, this is bright skin. Nice stickers. Uh, if we keep going, let's see. Did I skip over anything? Hopefully, I don't. Hopefully, I don't skip over anything important here. But nice, uh, nice skins, dude. Nice skins. Next page. He has. I, I do like your nicknames. Your nicknames are kind of funny. <laughs> Fun beach party. Wow, dude, that's morbid, my dude. <laughs> ESO one. He's gone, Doc. Yo, chill. Yo, some of these nicknames are... <laughs> they're a little toxic. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, chat. Some of these nicknames are kind of toxic. Uh, let's see. Ooh, this case hardened looks pretty good. I kind of like it. kind of like this. I think this looks pretty good. And uh, if we just keep going... What's inside here? Empty. It sure is empty. Next page, he has the Pandora's box gloves in the field tested condition. Low float field tested. Ah, oh. <laughs> get in there, dude. Nice, nice low float Pandora's box. You have. Congrats to you. Very very nice COD rank. <laughs> P2K silver. Uh, some of these nicknames. Wow. Jeez, he has the Olaf pass. Wow. <laughs> very nice, very nice. <laughs> My mixtape. <laughs> My gosh, you're killing me. P shooter, Glock 18 fade. <laughs> An op dragon lore. <laughs> okay. All right, buddy. Wow, I've never seen I've never seen this combo before. That looks really good. You got some really cheeky nicknames. I'll I'll tell you that. You got some really cheeky nicknames.
You got seven. You got eight hundred, quote unquote, shit skins and cases. <laughs> you better start donating some of those. <laughs> I know a lot of people who could really use some of these skins that are inside your storage unit. Um, you should you should consider joining my Discord server and uh, st and hosting some giveaways. You know, give back to the community. But it's completely up to you. You got a really cool inventory, my dude. A really cool inventory. Solid stuff. Solid stuff, man. Solid stuff. <laughs> like I said, you got some really cheeky nicknames. Holy moly! <laughs> Dang. Here, here, here's the Olaf pass that I know. I would rearrange the stickers though, but nonetheless, not bad, not bad. Yeah, absolutely, dude. Yo, yo, yeah. Join my Discord server. We can give you a nice, uh, a nice role as the giver. Um, uh, we'll, we'll talk. Join the Discord server. We'll get in touch. You got a really cool inventory, my dude. You got a really cool inventory. Nicely done. I'm really jealous of your Pandora's box. I think you're just amazing. These two knives are absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely filthy. And um, yeah, this dragon lure. I don't know, man. You're making me you're making me really depressed right now with this really cool inventory. Um, I'm gonna give you a 10 out of 10. Very nicely done. Thank you so much for trolling my stream and uh, donating. Thank you. Your P250? Did I skip over a P250? Oh my gosh, Jesus. Oh no. He has... I hate that these are foils, man. That's... Why are they foils? That's a beautiful Caddo Hollow, though. That's just gorgeous. Um, Yeah. Just gorgeous. Shivalaya coming in with the super chat. Thank you. Probably he spent more money on renaming items than most people spend on inventories. Absolutely, dude. You um you hit the nail on the head. <laughs> Absolutely he did. Nice dragon lure. This dragon lure is just just gorgeous. I I don't know what else to say. Just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. All right. Well, my eyes are bleeding from from this gorgeousness, so let's keep going. Where are we? D did I lose track? Okay, so... What on earth? Who's... Wait a second. Hold on. Give me one second, chat. Give me one second. Oh, brother. I I think I'm done. <laughs> I think I'm done, man. This is ridiculous. Oh, man. Alright, well, it looks like all of your... Okay, so... <laughs> I think this is a good place to stop, boys. Um, unfortunately, all of your messages got deleted inside of the inventory review channel. You can thank one of my mods for that. But anyways, I think this is a good place to stop, boys. Haha, <laughs> Gagger, dude, you're absolutely nuts. Thank you again for the $5 super chat. You're, you're absolutely filthy, man. <laughs> Just... Stop flexing, dude. Just stop flexing. But uh, join the Discord server, and uh, we can definitely do some... We can host some nice giveaways to the community, because I think it's a great... Uh, I try to give back whenever I can, and um, your inventory is just nuts. So thank you so much for sharing it. Unfortunately, boys, the inventory review channel got cleared. I apologize for this. It should not be cleared until I'm done streaming, but apparently it got cleared. So, yeah, you can go blame somebody for that hopefully not me we're gonna have to end it here chat uh i'm probably gonna take a few questions uh inventory questions csgo questions and uh we'll pick this up next week with another inventory review maybe next week we'll see we'll see how it goes uh let's go answer some questions right now 
If you guys have any questions, investment, trading, CSGO, any any questions, let me know. Um, and uh, yeah, let's. Uh, the link to my Discord is in the video description. It is at the bottom of this page. You should be able to scroll down and join the server. It's all on Nightbot. Screw you, <laughs> Nightbot man. Oh jeez. How do I give away skins? You have to join my Discord server, and uh, there is a giveaway bot that you can configure, and uh, you can host the giveaway. And uh, if you host enough giveaways, we'll give you a giver role, a special role on Discord for those of you who are generous enough to do giveaways. And um, I think it will be a good. So um, yeah, join my Discord server. Sorry, YTC. Um, yeah. I apologize for that. The next inventory review will be scheduled really soon, so you guys will know in a couple days. Uh, Kamal says, I have a Karambit lore. Which gloves should I buy? So you have a Karambit lore. I would probably go for like an er the, the Arid gloves. Those look pretty good. Um, also, hold on. Let me go into my game real quick. Even better than the lore, or th than the than the what you call it, than the Arid Gloves or the Omega Gloves. I would go with the Omega Gloves. They look really good with the um, with the lore knives. Uh, so, let's go back here into the chat. How you doing, Bonsai? Hope you're having a great day. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Uh, Aka says, how do I improve my $3 inventory to a $5 by not investing because I'm broke? I'm trying to sell my one and only fracture case. Yeah, so playing the game, every time you get a fracture case, make sure you sell it immediately. Just keep playing CSGO. You never know what kind of drop you're going to get. Uh, join giveaways, whether that be on, on like Twitter, on on uh, on my Discord. We tend to host giveaways on my Discord server, so join my Discord server. Be active there. Um, there are many ways that you can uh, build your inventory uh, without investing. Obviously, trading is another option, even though it's kind of hard these days. It's still viable. Um, Cody Fish asks, gloves with the Huntsman Slaughter. So the Huntsman Slaughter knife, uh, some good gloves for that. Maybe, you know what? I actually have a great suggestion for you for those. If I were you, I would go for the uh, Hand Wraps Slaughter. I think those look really good. Maybe go for like a low float field tested hand wrap slaughter. Uh, those might look really good. Um, obviously, minimal wear will probably look even better, but that's just my take on it. Let's see. Any other... Um, uh, what do you think about the Webstuck Hollow? Uh, what, do, what do I think about them? I think they're going to go up in price soon um, throughout the years. Um... Mostly under five dollar skins, but if people want them, I'd totally, I'd be totally down to do them. Absolutely, yeah, absolutely, man. Join the Discord server. We'll keep in touch. Like, yeah, I think, I think the community will really appreciate any any skin that they can get. You know, it's it's always good to give back. So even if it's like five dollar, three dollar skins, like, I think it's it's a great idea. How you doing, Dusan? Welcome to the stream, my dude. We're just answering some questions right now, so. Feel free to post a question. I'm all ears. I'm open to questions. Here to answer any questions you guys have. How much did you buy the... Oh, yeah. That's a great question. How much did you spend on that 5.7 Blue Gem? Uh, Bonsai says, What do you think is a better choice? To do a themed inventory or the skins I like the most? That is completely up to you, Bonsai. But what I would say is um, I would first get the skins that you like and then start building towards a theme. That's my personal opinion. Uh, you guys can disagree. Some people like to build uh, themed inventories first. I don't know. I think it's best to get your nice skins out of the way and then build around those skins, if that makes sense. Let's see here. Um... Lore says, even if I get a 50 cent skin, I'm going to be happy. Absolutely, Lore. Absolutely. Uh, what gloves should I get for a Huntsman? Uh, a Huntsman Tiger Tooth? Um, so a Huntsman Tiger Tooth, you know what? I have the perfect gloves for you. Huntsman Tiger Tooth, I think, will look really good with the hand wraps. 
Arboreal, I think they're called? No, not the Arboreal. The other ones. Shoot. Forget what they're called. <laughs> the Badlands? I think they're called Badlands. I think, um... I think the Badlands gloves will look really good with the uh, the Huntsman Knife, uh, Tiger Tooth. Uh, those will look solid. Um, yeah, hopefully that helps you out. Uh, hey, Fano, I got a Flip Knife Doppler Phase 2. What gloves should I get with it? So you have a Flip Knife Doppler Phase 2. So you want some gloves on that. Uh, gosh, some gloves with that. Oh man, um, <laughs> flip knife, right? Flip knife, flip knife. How much are you looking to spend on those gloves? He's saying moto or polygon. I actually like the polygon idea. The polygon gloves, they might not be bad. Uh, it really depends on how much you're willing to spend, but yeah, maybe some polygon gloves might look good. Um, yeah. <laughs> nice you guys are funny more sticker combos please yes I will try my best to have another sticker combo video for you guys I'm gonna try to find some cheap uh, sticker combos and make a nice video in the in the upcoming days so let's see here any other questions rate my three dollar inventory <laughs> it's up to you man it's up to you Please give me a frontside Misty skin. Uh, maybe one of these days I'll probably give away a frontside Misty. I don't have one at the moment, so sorry, my dude. He he says, Fano, why do you think that four of the same stickers are cool on one weapon? Do you like the AK-47 Aquamarine Revenge? I don't have a knife. <laughs> what? Are, those are like three questions in one. Um, I think four stickers that are the same, I think it looks good. I think in some cases it might augment the skin. It might make the skin look even flashier, even better, even even more expensive looking. That's why I think that four stickers on the same, like four of the same stickers look good, even though it's not really a combo, quote unquote. You want more trade-up videos? Absolutely, Med. I'm gonna probably try to record a, um, a trade-up video really soon, and I'll try my best to give it to you. Are you thinking of doing a face reveal one of these days? Why am I the only one who thinks Wildfire is slightly better than the Dragon Lore? Not factoring you, but something of a lower grade. I don't know. I don't know. I think the Dragon Lore is better, personally, but hey... Everybody's entitled to their own opinions. Uh, let's see here. How do you deal with bad players? Yeah, that's tough, man. I would say the, your best bet is to mute them. Report them and mute them. There's no like, there's no point in arguing with them. There's no point in tilting yourself and your team by arguing. You know, stuff happens, and it's you know, it's not worth. It's not worth. It's not worth it. Just mute, mute, and move on. And play with friends. Playing with friends is probably your best bet. Uh, you should do some one-on-one -on -one challenges with like a twist. For example, pistol only or sniper only. That's a great suggestion. I've been thinking about doing that. And I will let you guys know uh, in the future. What is your microphone? It is a Rode USB microphone. Uh, I got it a year ago and it's been really, really nice. Uh, why, why your computer... What? Banned? Why your comp banned? I'm not banned. What are you talking about? What? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, let's see here. What else? What else? Will you be happy if you got an op prince, Gungnir, or dragon lore? Not based on prices, but the style it looks. Yes, my ultimate goal is to eventually get a Gungnir and a dragon lore. I really like the both of those uh, skins. The prince is alright, but... um. There's just something about that Gungnir that I just really like. Unpopular opinion, Cato 2015 stickers are better than Cato 14 stickers. In non-hollow, at least. Interesting. Interesting. I sort of disagree with you on that. I actually... I actually think... 
the hollow Cato 15 stickers look better in some of them. Some of them, obviously. Some of them, obviously. Let's not let's not generalize all of them. Um, I agree with you, though, to a certain extent. Now, how are you doing gaming for life? I'm just answering some of your questions right now. But, uh, yeah. Yeah. Unpopular, but true. <laughs> That'd be interesting. The reason Cato 14 is literally a red square. Absolutely. However, the cat, the reason hollow is just on another level. So it's really hard. Like, I get what you're saying now. The normal sticker reason doesn't look that great. I agree with you. Some of the Cato 14 normals don't look that good. I absolutely agree with you. But that's not to say... You shouldn't say that... I think the hollows... The Cato hollows look really good. Some of them look even better than some of the, the, the 14 ones. That's just my opinion. Um, welcome to the stream, Jesus. How you doing? Uh, what do you think about the incineration hollow? I think it's a really good sticker. I would definitely use it and make some nice sticker combos with it. Is the SSG 553 integral a prime only drop? I think so. I think so. Could be wrong. I don't know. I don't know how you can verify that. I I'd, I'd imagine it is. How do you get CSGO Prime? I am new to CSGO. Well, first of all, welcome to CSGO Pran uh, Prane. Prane, hopefully I pronounced that correctly. Uh, to get a CSGO Prime, you need to... You can buy it, obviously. You can spend money. I think it costs, what, like $15 or something like that? I don't know when it's not on discount. So you can spend $15 and buy the game officially and get Prime automatically. Or you can get to a level... Level 21, I believe, 21, I think it was. You basically play the game and you earn XP by playing the game. And once you reach level 21 up here on the right, you, uh, I think you automatically can sign up to become Prime if you enter your phone number. If you register your phone number to your Steam account, to your CSGO account, I think that's how you get Prime. I could be wrong. Things have changed. Maybe, who knows? They seem to do a lot of things. Uh, but yeah, I think it's 21, and you have to link your phone number, and uh, that's how you get Prime. Let's see here. So, <clears throat> at least that's how it used to be. Alright, so, as my voice is dying, somebody asks, Gaming for Life asks, Hey Fano, what is your favorite AK skin not based on the price? My favorite AK skin. I made a video on that a while ago on YouTube. Uh, I hope I say the right one. I forget. Um, I think my favorite. Did I say the fire serpent? I really do like the fire serpent. I know. I'm, I know. I get a lot of hate for that, but I really do like the fire serpent. I think it is a gorgeous, gorgeous, uh, a gorgeous, gorgeous skin, regardless of the price or the hype or the rarity. Um, I like it, and I have my reasons for liking it. A lot of people hate on it because of the design, but I don't know. I like it. Love your videos. Keep up with the grind. Absolutely, man. Thank you so much. I have some really cool videos on the way, and I'm so glad you enjoy them. More videos on the way. Stay tuned for that. Um, <laughs> oof, minus rep for the Fire Serpent. Yeah, I, I know, I know. I have my reasons. Thoughts on the Wild Lotus? Uh... It goes good at, with a combo, with a green combo stickers. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Bro, go take a break too long of a stream. Absolutely, man. My voice is, is dead. My two favorite AK skins are Point Disarray and Aquamarine Revenge. Those are some nice skins. Absolutely. I like both of them. There really isn't an AK-47 skin that I don't like. There are very few AK skins that I don't like. Like, I genuinely just do not like them. Where should I buy? I can't find it on Steam. Please help. Oh, you're talking about the um, the CSGO stuff? The, the Prime? I think you can buy it. You go to... I think...
think what you do is you go to the Steam store and you search up Counter-Strike. It is free to play, but if you scroll down, here you go. If you scroll down, you should, there it is, buy CSGO Prime status upgrade. It costs $15 at the moment. It, I think it goes on sale during the summer and winter sales, and you can probably get a better deal on it then. But um, you go here, and you add this to your cart, and you get Prime. And you get better drops, you get uh, better quality matches, hopefully with less cheaters. Um, but yeah, you primarily, <clears throat> primarily get it for the drops. No problem, man, no problem. No problem. What is the difference between the AK Cartel and a regular AK? I really can't tell the difference. Yeah, the Cartel is, is, is a tough one, especially in low light. They look identical, so it's hard to really say what the difference is. I really don't know. I, I mean, it, it, when you inspect it, there is a difference when you inspect it, absolutely. Why is the Fracture case still so expensive? Uh, the reason is because it recently came out, and they don't drop a lot. Like, they, the, the drop rate isn't as big as it used to be back in the day. Back in the day, like many years ago, like, a new case comes out, it dropped really, really quickly. But these days, very f they, since we have so many active uh, uh, players, we have so many active players playing CSGO, they limit the drops and they lower the chances of you getting it, so that's why its price remains pretty constant and it's very slowly going down. Uh, if you get Prime status, do you only play with Prime status people? Uh, uh, that's a good question. That is a great question. I don't think so. I want to say you don't. It used to be that way, but I think what they do now is if you get Prime, your trust factor goes up. You have a high trust factor to start, and you get paired with people who also have similar trust factor as you. So you don't necessarily play with people that have Prime, but you play with people that have a good trust factor like you do because you have Prime. Hopefully that answers your question. Are you going to stream today on Twitch? I really hope I do. Um, I know I promised yesterday I would stream, but things got in the way. I probably will. I I really need to start streaming more consistently on Twitch. But uh, yes, I, I will try my best to, to play some games today. Do the drop chances increase when you buy Prime? No, they don't. But you get nicer skins. You, you, you have a better chance at getting rarer items so like some old csgo cases you have a better chance of getting those drops you also have a better chance of getting some more expensive uh csgo skins in the drops how do you deal with trolls on your team uh, yeah man just mute them that's all you can do report and mute nothing else you can do why is the gamma 2 case only 14 cents i don't know man i mean it's an old case and it's going up in price it, it will go up don't worry i'm sorry elias that i couldn't review your inventory i'll try my best to get through all of you guys in the next couple of weeks do you play competitive or scrims with subs i generally play scrimmages with subscribers and like 10 10 men's with subscribers but um if you guys are interested in playing competitive like i really don't care but the problem with that is we're going to get a lot of ping, and that might ruin the competitive experience for some people. So, yeah. Uh, do you like the Train CT Agent? I love that skin. But obviously, it ain't for sale, but I feel it's worth... What are your thoughts on it? The Train CT Agent? The Train CT Agent. What are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about. The train CT agent. Hey, Fano, I just got scammed for my whole inventory, but luckily I have some good friends and they gave me a little back and I got my friends to report the scammer. Can you also report him? Uh, Bebop, can you please uh, DM me on Discord? 
I never get skins and drops, only cases, but when I level up, then I get all the cool 4 cent skins. <laughs> yeah, you only get skins, you only get skins when you, uh, when you level up your, uh, CSGO, uh, rank. When you play enough games and you get XP and you rank up, that's when you, uh, get a skin every week. It's one skin every week. How you doing, Pyroente? The base model... Oh, the base model for CTs on train. What about it? I think I think they look cool. I just bought Prime. Do you get more XP with it? You don't get more XP with Prime, but uh, I don't think you do. You just get better skins in the drops and better chances of getting nicer, rarer drops, and you get and you get to play with less hackers. What's your most expensive drop you've ever gotten? That's a great question. I think the most expensive drop I've ever gotten was... That's really good. I have to think back. Dang. Most expensive skin. I I, I, I recently, last year, I got a... I got a... Uh, what's it called? Last year, I got an SG Integral. I got a Well-Worn... So forty dollars. That that was a pretty expensive. I got a Desert Eagle Emerald Jormungandr a couple months ago in a drop. You do get more XP? Interesting, maybe. You might be able to get more XP. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure how the XP system works with, with Prime. Most people don't don't purchase Prime because of the XP system. You do get more. Hmm, maybe. Yeah. But this week, I got two cases in drop and two skins in level up drop. You got two skins? Are you sure about that? I don't know, man. It resets every Tuesday. So every Tuesday at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, it resets. So once a week, you should get a, one drop every time you, you rank up your... Um, your uh, CSGO rank. It's it's one drop a week. Every Tuesday it resets. What do you think about the CT default knife and the King Snake gloves? It looks sick. Uh, the CT knife is a really cool knife. I like it. Absolutely. Make an Overwatch. Maybe on my Twitch stream. I usually do Overwatches on my Twitch stream, not here on YouTube. Sorry, dude. <laughs> Sorry, shock. My voice is is dying. I'm thinking of ending the stream in a in a couple in a minute. What's that bonus XP? The bonus XP basically gives you uh bonus five thousand XP. Basically, it's exactly what it says. So you get extra XP uh, if you if you uh, use it, and uh, you get this by uh, completing uh, operation missions. So during the last CS:GO operation, if you completed, I believe, five missions or so. You get uh, you get this bonus XP. You have a cool bayonet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I like it. Will you make a themed inventory ever? I I hope so. One of these days, I hope to make a really cool orange themed inventory. But uh, it's not a priority at the moment. All right, boys. I think it's about time I wrap this up. I've been streaming for a while. My voice is dead. Hopefully I can have my voice so I can record some videos for next week, but <laughs> I'm going to take a break. Thank you guys so much for watching the stream. I really appreciate everybody who donated, who shared their inventories with us. Uh, you guys are awesome. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope everyone has a fantastic rest of your day. And uh, yeah, have a happy and healthy week ahead. I'll see you guys next time, guys. So until next time, this is Fano. Signing out.